Yo, yo, friendos, thank you kindly for your poke of patience. Everything that could possibly go fucking wrong for a live stream has gone wrong, but we're good to go because I've been through the ringer before. Guys, thanks for poke of patience. We're gonna be live in like five minutes here. Ready to rock? I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money. The press will be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression. It's all that I wanted. The phone and affection. I summon and dub it. Cause I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money. The press will be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression. It's all that I wanted. The phone and affection. I summon and dub it. Why you be all in my line about? nothing why won't you go get you a dollar or something don't hang with it who lying for nothing i see that we different you riding i dub them i don't do discussions on bragging about hundreds don't go to your places i know that they sunken don't call me your brother i barely could trust it i talk to a shorty she bagging the bugging and i'ma need all of my dollars on corporate so hand me the money i divvy the pie i'ma give all of my people a portion to build them a fortune i'm flipping the ride i can't be mixy when iffy the vibe and 40 on 50 is really the time why are you all on my phone like you want me like you wasn't pushing the kid to the side i don't know if you Thinking I'm blind, cross on my crosses and dot on my eyes. Done with your efforts, I'm dealing with pressures. I know it's a lesson, that's what of the wise. Dubbing the mixes, I'm mixing. I know I've been missing, I needed some personal time. All the pictures, dimensions, I don't with your digits, I mean it, I'm staying inside. Cause they got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them, I run through the money, the pressure be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back, tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and dub it. Cause they got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them, I run through the money, the pressure be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back, tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted a full win affection, I summon and dub it. All right, friendos. Let's uh let's see how this goes.
I feel like we should run that back one more time. You know what I'm saying? Is my microphone on? That's all. We're off to a good start. Mud Pie. Clubber. Bloody Washer. Charizard Fart. Sup, G? What's going on? Chris Anderson. What's going on, man? Tyler Hendricks. Thanks for coming to kick it for a moment, bro. Appreciate you coming back. Let's, let's just... Let's just... Well, that was fun. Mud Pie, thank you. Smack Daddy, thank you. Clubber, thank you. Lord Voldemort, thanks. Appreciate it. That's really weird. Now let's just do this reveal. Guys, for real, appreciate every single one of you guys coming here to hang out. Let's just, let's just slow peel. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Friendos are going to put some jams on right now real quick. Right Meowth. I'm going to turn them down a little bit, hopefully, because it's probably super loud. Guys, thank you for coming to kick in another Late Night Legendary live stream. Appreciate every single person that showed up. I know I pushed it back tonight. There was, like, literally everything that could go wrong with, like, the editing and exporting procedure and then getting this set up live. Just, yeah, that's exactly how it went. And, of course, push the stream back and people are like, yo, WTF. Bro, where you get that fire beat for your stream? Which one, bro? <laughs> Which one? There's a few. Anyways... Friendos, thanks for coming to kick it on another late, late, late night legendary live stream. Fellow cardboard connoisseurs, pack cracking, magic fanatics, poke enthusiasts, all of you guys. For real, appreciate it. Lord Voldemort says, real nice, brother. Thanks, man. I fucking worked really hard on like getting that video done and everything for today. And I uh, was hoping some more of the Brolems and stuff would uh, come and kick it to check it out. But it is what it is. I appreciate every single one of you guys being here for real, for real. And yeah. Man, I've been stoked to like uh, reveal this for a while. Like it's been sitting here like behind my desk for a little bit. And I know it might not seem like that exciting or as exciting to some other uh, some other people. But for myself, this is a really big uh, like milestone or a mini milestone, I guess we should say, uh, for the most part when it comes to like content creation, having a company as awesome as this, as your playmat uh, reaching out, which by the way, I was supposed to have their thing up there, which I should, but um, reaching out and uh, saying like, yo, we really love your content. Like we enjoy what we see and like, it's absolutely awesome. Late night lit live stream. Yo, Mud Pie, I will cheers to that. Uh, the intro beat, I'm not sure which one I was utilizing, bro. Honestly, I just threw one on because I was like trying to get all this set up and all together and everything but but yeah anyway like having them reach out i was like super stoked and extremely grateful like beyond grateful to be contact with them back and forth uh when i received this playmat i had no idea what was going to be on it uh, when I, I when they reached out to me about the sleeves um like i knew what was going to be on the sleeves, so i designed the sleeves myself um the only other thing i will bounce over here really quick before i even show you guys the, uh, the actual playmat so if i go over here that's the wrong one no, it's not. It's the right one, but we're just like, this is how it's going tonight. Literally everything. I'm just like, yo. So anyways, I says to the guy, I says, hey, where's my window capture? And he says, I don't know, bro. We're going to have to find it right here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, no, that's not it. Hey, guys, welcome to total amateur hour for the most part. Let me see. That's what I wanted. It was up there before. Anyway. We'll go over here to your uh, your playmat. You guys can actually literally see some of the stuff that they actually offer on here, which is phenomenal. Um, I'm trying to see if we have the actual image of the stylization of sleeves that you can get because there's like a variation of them that you can get that I actually requested. Um, they were like, whoops, which is no big deal at all whatsoever. If I can see here, 
Uh, we'll have to actually go into the actual photos and stuff like that after, which is totally fine. But nonetheless, uh, the sleeves that they reached out to me for, I got to design and everything. They were supposed to have like a like a flame feathered edge on the inside, uh, but I'll be su super scooping up some other ones. They're pretty friggin' sweet. Um, the company in general is like super easy to work with and awesome to work with. You don't even have to get just these like stylizations. You can get your own complete customized branded, like with your own personal brand or whatever you want. Uh, done on the back of them, obviously just size them up accordingly, but print quality is absolutely phenomenal. It's quite high res, even for the um, project file that I did send to them. I probably could have sent them a better resolution file and they still managed to salvage it pretty well for this and the mat. Um, they fit like perfect fits inside of them as well too, which is pretty friggin' sick. Like these cards that are in here, the Charizard cards in here are perfect fitted. Um, and then obviously same thing as well too when I have like other dope cards inside them and I want to pull them out from the perfect fits. They just fit nice. Smooth transition. They're waterproof on the back. It's good. Not that you're going to ever be fucking, you know what I mean? Playing in the water with your cards. Kyle J says, lurking and working, Brolin. Thank you kindly, man. Appreciate it. Anyways, guys, of course, hunting some Zards in the Zard hunting sleeves right here. And like I said, I am beyond hydro pumped and stoked to be, uh, you know, cross collaborating with uh, with your playmat. So shout out to your playmat. There's going to be way more details coming, guys. If you want to check them out, there is a uh, like a link description in the description of this video uh, with my like personal code and everything on there. And like I said, I'm going to be having more details um on this or more specifications as well too and where you can get these ones just tonight i was trying to get i had so much time to do it and i was done but just like uh premiere wasn't rendering the file out for some reason and then i went to update or um open up stream labs and it was like yo update and i'm like oh my god everything i was like come on of all nights but without further delay let's move some of these charizard trainer tray zard hunting sleeves out of the way bomb yo friendos Tell me that isn't like so spice. Let's go. I freaking love those. Thank you kindly. Yo, third eye Giovanni's break room, guys. Thank you so much. Jessica, thank you too. Yo, but yeah, I am super stoked, guys. Like I said, more details. If you guys want to browse and peruse about the website yourself, you can most certainly do so. Literally just head over to your playmat. If you head over to their website, it's literally just gonna look like this right off the start. And I also realized that I had like talking tracks playing while I'm doing that as well, too. Um, yeah, if you head over to your play mat, you guys can check them out right there. And honestly, they have everything, all different kinds of uh, mats and shit. But anyway, super stoked. More shit to come. This thing's fucking glorious, man. I'm so grateful, yo. Shout out to your play mat for hooking me up and just like, yo, giving a content creator an opportunity. You know what I mean? So many out there that have and then so many that just haven't. And it's really, uh, yeah, it's really cool. Extremely grateful. Laura says, let's go. Yes. Want them sleeves for my Digimon deck. <laughs> the best part is you can put them in whatever you want. You can put them in whatever you want. That playmat is perfect for your live stream. Looks so good with the layout. Thanks, bro. Dude, Lordy, Lord. You know what I'm saying, bro? I had no idea, right? So when I like first got in contact with them, they were like, yo, we want to send you some sleeves, right? And then they like messaged me back and they're like, yo, like we really di we dig your stuff. <laughs> and uh, we want to send you a mat as well too. And I was like, man, like no friggin' way, so definitely stoked but when i sent them like i just sent them a high res file that i edited for the sleeve specifically right and then um i had no idea what the playmat was gonna look like so when it came in the mail like i was gonna unbox it live but i'm like nah i want to hype this up i want to make a commercial for it and everything too so um yeah that's what i've been doing that's what i was working on i crushed that out today just like just this afternoon for the most part and yeah super stoked as you guys can tell as i ocd fidget around with this thing looks so good love it trade john asked thank you kindly without further delay as i like repeatedly overly excitedly explain my game mat um picked up some chilling pain today some killing pain i have some modern horizons and i have a pack of king's court and we're probably going to crack into all of this and if i don't pull anything like we have been on stream for pokemon for the most part i might have something else that we'll crack into in celebration of this and it might rhyme with X my Lucians. Yo, dope Trey. What's the quality on the playmat? Yeah, Cosmo, I'm gonna be doing an actual like review review on this as well too. They requested that I do one, which is totally fine. Um, the quality is amazing, bro. It is so nice. Even the stitching, like on the edge, there's been there's I like I'll, in my top in my honest opinion, man. Like I've seen bad reviews about the company. I was like not skeptical at first, but I was you know what I mean. You go everything with like a certain amount of skepticism. I asked questions and they were like, yeah, like straight up, like if you have any problems, just let us know or anything and dude it rolls out nice it's nice and heavy it's gripped on this side it just rolls out clean it's weighted well stitched along the edge really nice i'm pretty sure you can order it so it goes even thicker on the inside you can get it without the stitched edge it's just clean all around man and the quality of the mat itself is really really nice extremely smooth like if you watch an intro video that i did for it like i don't know it's super nice man i have no complaints at all whatsoever my only complaint my honest complaint 
and it's not even complaining as i probably should have sent them a higher res file realistically but um yeah was well, just like the print on this but i think it's just because the gradation doesn't transfer as well onto like a fabric as it does like uh this you know what i'm saying so orange is an easy color on the eyes too it most certainly is that's one of my like favorite colors for that reason exactly that matte is sexy af laura thank you kindly appreciate it let me see love a tray i want a mug kip design matte and trainer tray style Ooh, that could be done that could be done i've had quite a few people reach out to me recently for some graphic work and stuff like that so thank you guys i really appreciate it for real it helps a lot if you guys are ever looking for design stuff let me know and i'll do what i can to a certain extent but yeah man tons of fun all right friendos we're gonna crack into some packs isn't that a beaut polka padre thank you kindly your it looks so good on those good enough for pokemon center Ooh, pokemon 2019 bro thank you dude that's a compliment and a half if i pull this up closer like i could but like you guys can see there's like a gradation on the on the charizard itself sorry if i'm talking so much about this guys i'm honestly just fucking super stoked and extremely grateful i know some people are probably like bro shut up but man i'm pumped and those are sick just to see my logo on the back of a fucking sleeve in a game mat is like that's some next level stuff you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying sick bro I'll definitely be hitting that up yeah guys like i said you can visit your playmat and you can check them out the link for them or the description the link for their website is in the description of this video and alongside that is my code um if you go through the link or go through the website that's linked at the bottom it, it'll automatically apply my personal code for this you guys will get 10 percent off everything on the store um but you guys can also uh, hit me up if you guys want to order one of these specifically um you can just have them like make these specifically it's pretty cool i'll hit you up, i'll hit you up if you're down mud pie yeah most certainly if you're looking for something like this variation or this style let me know it looks dope too because this pops up the Charizard pops up on stream or the actual logo pops up right there. So small steps, guys. It's been so many years, so many years we've been rocking this channel. And uh, yeah, so that's why I'm so excited. You know what I mean? So thank you guys for everybody that did come here tonight to support. Really appreciate it. I know it's not the most hype thing for everybody, but um, let me see. Trade commission and new play mat. Mud pie, Arceus bless. Let's get into this. Let's uh, rip into some chilling pain. Shout out EB Games. Always uh, letting me know when some packs are back and restocked. Did everyone spank that like button? I absolutely hope so. You guys wouldn't mind please do so we're gonna start getting into some of these packs and just like man that looks clean just like third eye said orange is uh orange is an easy color on the eyes nice looking all right spanks hard charizard farts thanks bro appreciate it bro do we have something in this pack do it no we don't i thought i seen something but probably not online pokemon trading card game pack code for my brolems and lasses who are rocking the game one two three to the back here we go wait of course i had to wear the matching sweater tonight too you know what i'm saying i had to the og one joe kryptonite says yo yo what i miss people just a commercial that i worked on a lot we'll we'll we'll, we'll play the commercial out again a couple times throughout the stream maybe it's like i said i did um man i i hand bombed all of that without the gimbal or anything so i know you guys might not understand but quite a bit of work letty ba squovet crab brawler Reverse Hollow Aaron and come on, first pack magic. Can we have it? No, we can get a fucking Slurpuff right off the hop. It followed by some fire. No, some fighting instead. Let's go trade. Maybe not the time or place, but after recent events, I'd really like to be more responsible for my health and take better care of myself. I'd love some advice if I could reach out. Cosmo, uh, bro, I'll tell you right now, and it's okay. No, that's it's not a matter of time or place, man. I completely understand because I was in your uh, situation before, similarly, um, just with that realization and stuff. Of course, man, hit me up um and anything i can do to help especially from like my situation and everything that i was dealing with yeah for sure trying to build a following is a hard mission yeah most certainly especially when people of a higher tier are, i don't know whether they're they feel threatened or i don't know yeah especially when a lot of people try to shit on your parade for no reason you know what i mean but gimbal i love that word i love that tool it's a good tool you know what i'm saying um, but yeah, Cosmo, hit me up, man. I'd be glad to help you out. Most certainly just offer any constructive advice or like opinions or anything like that that might help. I'm going to bring this over here so we're not looking at my door. There we go. Um, and I'll do what I can to help you for sure. Yeah, but John, you're absolutely correct, man. It is difficult. It's an absolute mission to the fullest extent. But if you're resilient and you stick with it, trust the process, have fun along the way and don't really worry about the numbers and stuff like that. And just like I look at it this way, I've spent like over half a decade honing my craft to be able like to whip up a dope commercial for a cool product to have a company be like hey like we really like your stuff you know what i mean you know what i'm saying so Le andy no worries bro it's all good my dude thanks for coming to kick it thanks man you're a legend cosmo no worries bro you are a legend you guys are legends for being here guys i'm gonna let the commercial bump out i'm gonna throw a t-shirt on because it's like 8,000 degrees in here and i have my my loyal zard hoodie on and i'm sweating my ultra balls off so here you guys can check out this again i'm gonna play this a couple times tonight because i'm 
I didn't when I rendered this video out, I had no idea if it was like if I fucked anything up because I just kept like trying to get it out and then it finally started working and I'm like Gotta go live in like 20 minutes. Let's hope for that. All right friendos. Let's check it out. Ready? Are you ready? Cool, that turned out okay. I could have done a billion times better, but you know what? Happy with it. Yo, this t-shirt looks messed up on camera. Oh my God, yo, do you guys see this? This looks like 3D, oh. Goodness. All right, okay, there we go. Anything that could go wrong tonight has, but I'm gonna be, uh, I'm just gonna say that I'm grateful as fuck for today in many capacities and many aspects. So yeah, we're not gonna let, not gonna let it bother us. All right, we got a couple packs of Modern Horizons. We've got some Chilling Rain left and some Vivid Voltage and that one pack of King's Court and we're gonna hope for the best. Let's go over to the MTG side. Let's get it. Well, that was sick AF. Laura, thank you kindly, I appreciate it. That was quickly whipped up. Quickly whipped up. Uh, nice show. Takes me like five minutes. To... <laughs> yeah, amen, bro. That's all right. I think it probably takes me about four seconds. No, no, not tooting my own horn. Probably practice way too many times. Now, will the shoes match the shirt? No, no, bro. I got flip-flops on. I don't know if you guys are seen on IG, but I went super hard today. And then I came back here and just started editing like a madman. And I thought I'd have more than enough time. And then, of course, just like one sequential thing after another i called it to i jinxed myself because i'm like watch i'm gonna i'm gonna open up Streamlabs and it's gonna need an update i clicked on it update and it never happens like and then of course it happens that's how it goes shay what's going on hello hello thanks for coming to kick it on a late night legendary live stream appreciate you guys for real if you wouldn't mind mega punching the shit out of that like button on the way in that would be legendary pull this up a bit more there we go all right tour mods crypt keeper we got a razor tide bridge meyer scrappling silver bluff bridge Come on, what else we got? Rakdos Headliner, is that what that is? Yep. Such a crazy, freaky as fuck looking card. Look at that shit. Wait. Wait. Camera. We're right here. No? Not today? Come on, baby. You don't want to cooperate? Let's go. Fine. Fine. You're getting replaced anyway, young lady. All right. Sweep the skies. Ooh, nice. Prismatic ending, but... Uh, a fancier border, we'll say. Joe Kryptonite says, uh, you gotta get the raw. Oh yeah, that's that's the cheater's way, bro. But yeah, definitely. <laughs> Probably the best invention of my <laughs> of my lifetime, yo. Definitely better than the smartphone. Oh my God, that's too funny. No other way to but go hard. That's exactly it, most certainly. Most certainly. Karmic Guide coming in as our rare out of Modern Horizons. We got something behind it, maybe a slapper. Territorial Kavu, we got a double, uh, double rare followed by a Timeless Dragon token. We'll take that. That's the one we won't whip behind us. And we're actually gonna bounce over and see what those are going for because why not? All right, yo, thank, thank goodness streams rolling smooth and everything though. I guess that's something that could go wrong that's not going wrong, but my stream labs was fucking up this morning. John S, I'm sorry to hear that, bro. I know, it's how it goes sometimes, man. I don't like it. I don't, I don't like it. All right. Territorial Kavu, oh my God, no way. 50 cents, what? 
Bro, that's sick. I'll take it. And Karmic Guide. Ooh, another big not so slapper. Uh, 75 cents. So Modern Horizons 2, not uh not too crazy thus far. But you know what is crazy is this absolutely dope mat. And I can't get over how sick it looks. Like just it looks proper. I don't know. I like it. It's the little things over time that you're like, yes. Yes. I need to top you for my B-Day, Laura. What is that? Why? What, did, did Laura get you something dope for your B-Day? Or what are we talking about? What are we saying here? Put these rares off to the not-so-rare pile. Is what we're going to do right here. And let's try Vivid Voltage. It's been a while. Can we just get a Rainbow Rare Pikachu right off one pack magic? Like, that would just be... Come on. Time-traveling onion pack. And followed by a giant ins electrical insect pack. And... Come on. Dear Arc, yes, please. This would be sick. Our luck with Pokemon has been absolutely poop soup for the most part. One, two, three. Here we go. Galarian Stunfisk. Sableye. Cramorant. Chimeco. Blitzel. Slugma. Beldum. Milsery. Milkery? Milsery. Reverse hollow, gross pile of metal, and... Hashtag, I like that. I do like that. You know what else I like? I like, I like a hit. You know, a holographic shaman is not too bad, and I'm definitely gonna take it. That is sick, man. That card hits different. Look at that. Woo! Ain't no shame in liking that hollow, you know what I'm saying? Followed by some leaf energy, and I'll cheers to that. Chris said my B-Day is in a month and four days, bro. Well, happy early birthday, one month and four days from now. And if you happen to be here kicking it on a late night legendary live stream during your birthday time, maybe we'll cheers again and crack some packs, you know what I'm saying? Oh, shout out to, um, pick the can away. Shout out Rain Energy, hashtag not sponsored, hashtag that'd be cool as fuck though, hashtag it'll never happen though because apparently they're not a fan of Trainer Trey. <laughs> not too shabby, third eye, thank you kindly. I can't, oh, I'm a dad of four and I'm tired of AF by 8.30. I'm dying just staying up till 10, which is my son's bedtime. <laughs> I'm weak sauce AF, bro. Ain't no shame in that at all whatsoever, bro. You work your balls off, you know what I'm saying? You work your polka balls off. Mmm. Laura, that is insane. You are nuttier than Squovert shit. That is crazy. Are you for real? Absolutely legendary last. I almost like am upset that you were, were like, you know what? I'm going to stay here. I'm almost seeing the light, but you know what? You know what's more worth it is a trainer trace stream. That's humbling. That's too kind. <laughs> Holy ultra balls. All right. Our hits tonight are this Shaman. I'm not even gonna look what it's at. It's probably going for around like an hour. I legit laughed, yo, of course. I got three Shining Fates packs tonight. Yo, Joe Kryptonite, let us know what you get, Brolem. Let us know what you get. Laura is a straight savage. Laura is a legendary lass is what she is for real. All right, we have pulled absolutely nothing out of these King's Court sleeved packs. And let's just see if we can do it again. I was gonna keep this one sealed, but we're not going to. We're just gonna mash around all of the TCGs tonight as we usually have been doing because why not? You know what I'm saying? If you're, gonna be a if you're gonna be a TCG addict, just throw it all into one big bubbling pot. So crazy, Laura. I'm glad that you're okay now, for real. Just insane. Shirk! What is going on, bro? And thank you kindly for coming to kick it. Rivalry, rivalry of Warlords. Reinforcement of the army. Have you guys seen any more information on uh, the Generations singles? Celebrations? Fuck. Celebrations singles um, that have been popping up, obviously. Like, people have. I've seen people still speculating like all oh, these could not be or these could possibly not be the actual cards but i think at this point in time the hypothetical is outruled by the reality that those are the cards that will be in the set so but think of a tray if uh you went live that night and i attended the live after fair i guess we'll say yo <laughs> crazy all right let's go Oh man, Boxia, Baxia or Boxia? Brightness of the Yang Zing. Every time like we open up these cards, just the friggin' names on some of them is just insane. Jax Knight, we were talking about that last time, I think, which is Yu-Gi-Oh! nowadays. Like just having to read that entire card if you wouldn't know what its effect was would just be like a, a fucking chore during the time you're playing. Jax Knight, Jack Septic Knight, Ties of the Brethren, and there's two more actually, I don't know what I'm doing. ZW Tornado Bringer, what the hell? We've literally never pulled that in all the packs that we've ever had. 
That's a badass looking card. Yo, that's like a mix between Rayquaza and Slifer the Sky Dragon. And a robot. I had to throw that in there. Definitely had to throw that in there. Okay, ready? Come on. Oh! Yo! Is this... A Andy. Andy, how are we doing? Andy, do I check this? Do I give this a look? I want to say this is okay, but it might not be okay, but it might be okay. I'm going to say it's all right. Yo, nothing does get past Laura, for real. Yo, I also saw in person a $90,000 Deoxys sealed box. Yo, Shirk, what? Oh, oh, sorry, Shirk just said, I went to the 41st National Sports Car Convention and Pokemon basically anything tradable. Yeah, on Sunday, and was lucky enough to get some free MetaZoo promo cards and first edition MetaZoo packs. Shirk, that is crazy, bro. One of my brolems, yo, I don't know too much about MetaZoo, but I will say shout out to a uh, to a legendary brolem for real man uh but hit me up today and was like yo i have a first edition meta zoo booster box with your name on it and i was like what the fuck so i'm definitely super stoked um i don't know if i'm probably just gonna keep it sealed in a box to be completely honest or maybe crack it with you i don't know we'll see we'll see how it goes yo that's a decent hit i just learned uh super shenron is bigger than a galaxy yes he is absolutely massive he is a galaxy in essentially but shirk that is so sick man to see that deoxys sealed box that's legendary man i've seen some over time but not when they were worth that much when i was like oh that's cool i don't like that pokemon set and now it's like oh it's ninety thousand dollars it's like a ten dollar us hit yo six so Yu-Gi-Oh coming in decent tonight andy that's not bad we'll pull over to uh right here it's already up what am i even doing there it is let's try there uh, let's go okay Yeah, King's Court First Edition Joker's Knight is coming around 15 bucks. So that's not too shabby at all whatsoever. Yu-Gi-Oh! definitely taking the dub so far, thus far tonight. I can't complain when you're able to get some trading credit. It's pretty sick. I'm not going to keep this for myself. I'm hunting that obelisk, man. That obelisk is what I want. And I'll probably keep opening up King's Court until we probably pack that obelisk. Obelisk hunting. Whoever fucking thought I'd be doing that. MetaZoo, more like Mega Poo. My personal opinion on it is never something that I like wanted to chase, but like I mean from Shirk's perspective, like getting some free product from something that might potentially like in the future people will remember it and want to open it up, or who knows, man. Speculatively, who knows? But um, what's the deal with the MetaZoo cards, man? I've seen and they have some dope artworks, just don't know much about it. Yeah, Joseph, um, personally, honestly, I don't know much about it either, bro. I'm like, I'm uh, complete transparency with me here on my channel, fucking as always. But yeah, man, it's not something that has like grabbed my attention because just certain other things surrounding it as an entirety, like just left me like not so interested plus like i said man i've been i'm more of like a, a big anime fan so like i've been stoked for like one punch man cards demon slayer cards looking up other tcgs i can get like inuyasha cards and stuff like that too so anime trey has been looking for stuff like that to crack into which i've been super stoked about plus being a fan of magic the gathering with all the new sets that are coming out pokemon with celebrations and evolving skies coming out being a fan of <laughs> i've been cracking the new digimon as well too some of the Yu-Gi-Oh packs so as you can see man on top of working and everything else that i'm doing sometimes like pulling on another tcg onto my plate that i'm not like oh my god i'm so excited about this but with that said would it be cool to open some definitely i would give it a go you know i'm going to come to the uh come to the one in 2023 i'm only five hours away yo get it get it i'm likely going to be um attending um uh collecticon is what i'm going to be attending yeah, it'll be a good time for sure. You guys uh, meet, meet up there. Yo, we should have a trainer trade meet up at the next Collecticon. If I'm able to get out there, like with the legalities and all that bullshit for me crossing the border, if we're able to hit a Collecticon, let's hit a Collecticon, friendos. Uh, let me see for sure. I'm sure. Yes, down. Um, I got the rundown this weekend. Apparently, the weather you're currently experiencing in real life affects the gameplay. So you build a deck around your climate in some respects. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's entertaining. I mean, that's that's pretty cool. Imagine it's like, holy shit, we're in the middle of a tornado. I wonder what kind of cards are made for that, you know? John S. saying, yo, dub dub. Digimon, digital monsters. Digimon are the champions. They are. Digimon are the champions, bro. Speaking of Digimons and being the champions, I just want to see something here. Just want to do a quick checkeroo. No, I thought I did. You know what's crazy is that I still have these and I still have yet to crack them. Man, just having those, I'm just gonna put those there. That's a tease. 
I don't think I'm gonna open them. We're gonna leave them there. MetaZoo, Tasa in the back of the closet, and in 20 years might be worth 100 bucks. Yo, Angela right there. Uh, creator straight up lied to my kid, and I totally went for from fan to fuck this. Oh, really? Is it? That's crazy. I've heard some other circumstantial things around it as well, too, which people just being completely unhappy. Uh, there's actually, I'm not gonna name the, the company because it's not my place to say, but there is a relatively local game shop. Um, actually, there's two, technically speaking, that were extremely upset with the allocations that they got because when it got to them, it was like severely damaged. Like the boxes themselves were damaged card quality was like not great but like then you see on the flip side there's people that are absolutely loving it and thoroughly enjoying it and everything right so there's always two sides of the coin um for the most part i'm really sorry to hear that angela though that's really unfortunate that sucks that sucks uh that's pretty dope are they like valuable or not yet really i just never see them at my local game shops yeah i don't think you'll see it at your local game shops just yet maybe like it, like i don't know around here they're starting to uh but i think it's kind of more or less like i don't know it's by choice sort of deal like some are choosing to and some are choosing not to but where's the collecticon i think the next one's gonna be in vegas again if i'm not mistaken hey trey i'm gonna head out hashtag replay squad good night chris anderson my dude yo thank you so much for coming to kick it bro appreciate you coming by and showing some support as always train on game on stay epic stay awesome and i will catch you on the next one bro much love thank you but yeah i mean i think some of the cards are valuable some of them have seemed to be valuable to an extent like i said this is all just like i'm talking out of my ass kind of sort of it's kind of like forced upon you if you're if you're involved in the pokemon community and like even a minute capacity with some of like the current you know like popular content creators a lot of like i don't know like bigger influencers I, I hate even saying that in the hobby you're always seeing that kind of stuff like you're always like i see metazoo shit all the time i shouldn't say metazoo shit i see metazoo stuff all the time you know what i'm saying but like i said i'm never to be like yo sick Who, who is that? Anime Trey. Yo, that looks clean on the screen. That looks clean on the screen, yo. <gasps> who is that? <laughs> Reveal yourself so I can love you. Yo, Anime Trey. Yo. <laughs> Thank you. What the fudge sickles, bro? I don't know why I'm hesitating to say fuck on my stream. Like, I don't say it all the time. What the fuck, yo? Thank you. What? <laughs> Destiny is calling Demon Trey, or yo. <laughs> That is legendary. Yo, thank you, a Snorlax size shit ton. Yo, oh my god. Holy shit. That's a mighty swing of Trunk Z Sword right there. Yo, that's insane. Thank you kindly. Fifth. Oh, man. Destiny is calling Demon Trayer. Yo, wow. I can't get over that already. <laughs> train him it. Train him it. Train him it. Mud Pie. I like it. Dub, Dub Dub says, oh, hi. Uh, yep, damage was a huge issue. If you're a fan of uh, Gary Rudy or fan or of gary or rudy you are a fan otherwise whatever it blew up after gary oh, okay yeah, my kiddo turns 15 on wednesday well happy early birthday that's awesome i hope you guys are able to like reconcile a, like a better celebration and not have to like deal with that kind of nonsense i'm sorry to hear that honestly that sucks angela my local car shop said they don't play a plan to carry metazoo at all yes one of my local ones too as well they're like we don't want to you know what i mean your local scalper says take my money got an mtg tonight bro not really i got one pack of modern horizons two left i still can't get over that De destiny is calling demon trayer yo <laughs> Thank you, Anime Trey. You're such a gentleman. All right. Uh, yeah, not really, bro. I have one pack right here. I was just cracking into before we got a legendary donation right there, which is insane. Urban Daggermouth. Guys, Anime Trey is going to be replacing Trainer Trey. I'm just saying. Just saying. Er Ethereum Spinner. Tavern Scoundrel. Landscaper Kolos. Kolos? Kolos. Vermin Thing. Arrow Amoeba. Hey, Polka fam, Polka Gains, what is going on, my dude? Thanks for coming to kick it, dude. Appreciate you being here. All right, Galvanic Relay, Phantasmal Dreadmaw, Arcbound Javelier, Liquid Metal Torque, Herd Balith, Zoran Orb. I was acting like we were going into the rare, but now we are, I think. Now we are. Okay. Come on. I love. <laughs> Poker games, you should have been like, I love Trey. Dot 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 n. <laughs> Yo, Oof. guys, are do we just really rip up a Dakon? 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 It reminds me of Gaston from, you know, Beauty and the Beast. You guys know Disney jokes. You guys know. No one cracks packs like Gaston. No one swings a sword like Gaston. That's not really what it says, but anyway. 
Oh my, okay. I got excited because I thought there was going to be something else. This is actually the promo that comes with this set, which is funny because of all cards that you can pull out of here. This is what I rip. Like when you crack a, um... oh, maybe this is actually good because this is actually a different one. All right, maybe we'll have to see because this is the one from the, um, like the promo when you buy like the building battle kits, essentially pre-release packs. Jesus, too many TCGs. Who the fuck is Trainer Trey? I only know Anime Trey. I love it with the three backwards too. It just looks badass. I just feel like sometimes people would be called like Anime Treb. Like, man, do you guys know that for the longest time I had to change my... Um, I know Disney. <laughs> for the longest time, people on my thing thought my uh, IG was like T-Rex Grim. Not like Trey with an X as a space because you couldn't like... I didn't use an underscore. They thought it was like Trey T-Rex Grim. So people were like messaging me like, yo, what up T-Rex? And I'm like, damn it. Who the fuck is Trainer Trey? I don't know who T Trainer Trey is. We're gonna find out. This Zur and Orb uncommon might be good as well, too. Joseph, I can't get over how cool some of the artworks and magic are. Joseph, seriously, like over the years, if you uh, throw it back to some like really, really old magic sets as well, too, and like, I mean, man, any lot, there's lots of old magic sets, but um, even like original Innistrad, there are some crazy, insane artworks that like, it's cool too because like tons of magic fans over the years obviously have a lot of their like favorite artists artwork blown up and you would never know it was a magic card ever and like i just feel like a lot of them just don't get the you know what i mean that the acknowledgement that they deserve to certain points in time so i love this story isn't it a good one andy <laughs> i'm guilty of that at first see some people were it's okay it's how it goes how was y'all's day poke games thanks for asking man my day was awesome man i had a great day up in here like a javelinier yo i want to be a javelinier javit javelinier 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 you know what i'm saying uh don't take my word on the game that's just my sorry guys I got a cord in the way that's just my experience i think there'll be um a thing for a bit but then die out to be honest hard to get in canada or anywhere now but it'll be unlimited later yeah that's very true yo <laughs> <laughs> underscores are the best that's why mud under pie has extra exactly Ooh, i like it the double gap right there wife's made name is grim almost took her name yo that's crazy bro that's crazy shoulda bro cosmo i'm glad you're doing better man again thanks for coming to kick it guys show some love to cosmo just uh, underwent two separate surgeries as well too and still here being a legendary gentleman and spending some pos positive energy man for real appreciate you thanks on the birthday wishes we'll pass it on uh she ditched me to go to camp for a 10-day canoe trip hey can you can you blame him at that age you know <laughs> we're gonna do pokemon mtg digimon thing i think stick to the good shit yo that's awesome man that sounds like fun I hope you guys enjoy. If you guys didn't see the commercial tonight that I dropped for this mat and you guys want to see it, let me know and I'll play it again. Because honestly, I'm watching it and like seeing, looking for things that I might have messed up because I rendered it and just put it on here. So anyway, we're going to check out the prices of some of these cards. This is Dakin, first of all. So uh, if you guys didn't see the Yu-Gi-Oh hit that we got, that Joker's Knight came in around 15 bucks, which is pretty decent. So, um, okay. That's the borderless version. Wow. In just his regular version, I thought he would definitely go for a lot more. Um, but that's okay. Still such an insane, insane artwork. It's so cool to be able to blow them up like this and like look at them on a larger scale. At least I'm looking over here and you guys are looking over there. So he's a three drop white. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enters the battlefield. Number of loyalty counters on him equal to the number of lands you control. Holy shit. That's crazy. Surveil to exile target creature for a minus three. You may put an artifact card from your hand or graveyard on the battlefield. That's that's good. Oh, I'm reading the effects and you guys cannot even see. Such a butthole. Love and respect to Cosmo Poca Padre. That is awesome. West Bragg, I missed it. Let me see. Yo, I can definitely blast it again for sure, guys. I will. We'll check out the other price on this card right here. This uh, year three Fortune's Flame. I don't think it's gonna be anything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, that's not the one we're looking for. Oh yeah, it is the one we're looking for. Yeah, nothing crazy. Even as a foil rare, only coming in at approximately a dollar, but still a pretty spicy friggin' card. Nothing I would ever use. What? Yu-Gi-Oh! is winning for once. I know it is, right? Seriously, it's insane. Okay, um, let's go back over here. And I'll let you guys rock the commercial one more time real quick. I'm literally going to play it for anybody who asked that didn't see it tonight because, honestly, like, it took some time today. <laughs> and I'm critiquing it myself. So, here, enjoy.
That's all right. That's not too shabby. That's okay. Anyways, there it is. I'll play it a couple more times. Is there an orb? That's what I want to check as well, too. It's probably worth more. Wow. Is there an orb that this card that we just pulled, the uncommon, is worth as much as, like, the rares for the most part? West Bragg says, noise. Thank you kindly, man. Appreciate it. I want a Bulbasaur, Ivasaur, Venusaur, Leaf Energy playmat so bad. Ooh, smack daddy. I want to do all three like this. We did the Blastoise variation like this, right? You know what I mean? Like, I had the Blastoise one done like this, which is pretty sick, but... You can put this on your resume. Nah, bro, I wouldn't put this one on a media resume. That one's just for fun. That one's just a funsy one. I wouldn't put that. I put the, like, uh, Zard, the Viridian Forest one. I put that on a resume because that was, like, some drone flying and everything as well, too. That was cinematic as shit. I thought that video was definitely going to perform better, and people are just like, nah, nah, no fucks given. All right, so coming out of those packs, nothing too, too crazy. That Dakon is still pretty sick. Pack on, Dakon. Put these bad boys off to the side. We'll get it. Sky. Dude, yo, Poke Gains, thank you kindly. That manicure, though, some model hands. Ooh, dude, always, bro. Always. If you open packs on the internet, like, dude, and I think about it too, look at this. I know that's disgusting, isn't it? I just, my hands are so callous. Poke Gains knows exactly how it goes, bro. If you pick up heavy things and put them down, your hands are all fucked. Um, but yeah, always make sure your hands are clean, bro. You know how many people I watch that just have poor hand, like, not even just coordination, but cleanliness? Wash your hands. You know what I'm saying? Damn, dude, looks pretty fucking professional. Did you edit that yourself? Joseph, yeah, I edit everything that you see on my channel. Like, I have, like, a couple of my homies helping me with stuff, but, like, that I shot, edited, recorded, mixed, mastered. Like, if you guys seen the timeline for it, I should post the timeline for it. I should edit a video one night with you guys live just so you guys can see some of the shit that goes into, like, anything. Yeah. Yo, Michael Jeffrey says, I was literally going to buy a new playmat on eBay today, but I decided I need something better, but this... This I need. Yo, RCS Bless, man. Appreciate you a Snorlax size shit ton. Hit me up on IG. You can also um, go, like, if you go to the link or the description, if you go to the description of this video, the link in there will bring you to your, your Playmats website. Um, There it is right here. It'll bring you to this website right here, and you'll be able to utilize that code for 10% off anything in there. But if you contact them, if anybody is interested in one of these Zard playmats, the best thing for you guys to do is you guys can contact um, your playmat and just be like, yo, Trainer Trey is someone who you guys just sent a product to, and I want that. And they will be like, okay, done. Um, the worst is when they bite their nails badly in open packs. Oh, Smack Daddy, you're so right. That's awesome, man. It looks really good. Joseph, thank you kindly, bro. It was really quick. That was a pretty quick one. I, like, recorded it yesterday, put it, took the scenes that I wanted, and then uh, I was going to, like, upload it or do the live for this yesterday, but I didn't want to rush it. So, yeah, it turned out okay, man. Like I said, just before I went to go live, like, it wasn't rendering out. So, I'm like, man, I'm just gonna... The one time that it did, I'm like, okay, hopefully this works. So, and that's what turned out. So, Wes said, everybody needs to smash that like button and subscribe for Trey. Yo, Wes, thank you kindly, man. I'm gonna rub my hands in dirt and mud and open some packs and record the over just to see how many people cringe. Andy, that's a great idea, bro. <laughs> that's a great idea. Skyju says, YouTube, uh, YouTube really have a serious problem. I went on the stream earlier to give a like, and my like isn't there anymore. Yo, see what I'm saying? I don't know if you guys seen that as well earlier, but, like, there was a video. It's back up on the likes now, but, like, yeah, it does, Skyju. I've watched and noticed that in so many videos. My subscriber count literally says that I have gone up, like, like we should be, like, 150 plus, technically speaking, more than where we are. Makes no sense. Andy, that's such a dope idea, bro. Hit me up. Let's collaborate and do a... <laughs> Yo, I just want to, like, rub my hands in a bunch of gross shit. Like, just, like, get some of the grossest stuff I can, you know? Slime and, like, snot and just, like, throw up in a thing. And then open up some, like, XY Evolutions packs. And just pray for no pulls. Ooh, just call it pray for no pulls with dirtiest shit hands, you know? Opening packs while eating KFC, yo. <laughs> hey, Jabroni Josh. <sighs> I smell what you're cooking, bro. Yo, thank you kindly, dude. That is a cool playmat. Nice, bro. And thank you kindly. Appreciate it for real. I would die, Andy. Yeah, that's disgusting. Joseph said that was like the one dude to open a first edition Team Rocket booster box and pulled the Charizard and put the Charizard in a blender. Like, what? Okay, that's just kind of savage, bro. I mean, that's just, you're just spoiled, I guess. I mean, it's your own car. You do whatever you want. If it's yours and you own it, I never, literally, man, I never bitch or fucking complain. I don't have the audacity or like the ignorance to be like, how could, like, just, you know? If somebody's gonna do it they're gonna do it but i can also say that is stupid as shit <laughs> why would you do that put a first edition team rocket charizard in a blender i mean for the views right you got to do it for the views or the culture or i wouldn't say that's the culture unless your culture is like doing some stupid shit but to each their own bro i ain't gonna hate could do it in front of me I'd be like that's dumb as fuck right to your face you'd put it in a blender and be like yo 
That's your Charizard, but that's dumb as fuck. It's my opinion. Opinions are like assholes. Almost all of us have one, you know what I'm saying? So, Modern Horizons 2. Speaking of which, actually, you know what? Let's open this last pack of Chilling Pain and just get this shit over with. Let's get it. It's easy to hit the wrong buttons like the dislike or subscribe, seeing as we're on the touch screen phones. Happens to me a lot. Yeah, Pokemon 2019, that's exactly how it goes. Especially when it's like a tiny little, like, thing. You know what I'm saying? I thought the guy who put the Dark Charizard in a cup of lube. What? That's even... That's even... That's kind of hot. Kind of spicy. Okay, I've arrived, Bloody Washer. Thank you. Thank you, Pop Pop. Thank you for watching, Pop Pop. Yeah, I appreciate it. He was uh, he was some Twitch streamer who was pissed about the hype Pokemon was getting and wanted to flex. That's unfortunate, bro. Because like a lot of people would like. I mean, it is what it is. Like I said, I can't. I hate when people are like. That's like that thing when they're like, when you like have some food and there's like, yo, there's other hungry people in the world, and it's like, well, like, man, how do I get this food to them? right now like i would like to it's like the same thing with like i would love to but but i guess in that circumstance it's like that's just kind of a dick thing to do right <clears throat> that's like a piece of history sort of oh well populations down more prices go up realistically if he was upset about it what he did was contribute to the exponential growth and inevitable price hikes because now you made the population of them more or less you know what i mean Whereas what he should have done was graded it and then that... <laughs> Wait, almost all of us? That would suck. Michael Jeffrey, I have to say it because I can't say all of us. You know what I'm saying? So... Uh, <laughs> good wasn't container. <laughs> Yucky. Yeah. Yeah, and they stink uh, you, They stink your shitter? What stinks your shitter? Piece of shitstery. Um, I know, bro, like the value of that card would change the most ordinary people's lives. Yeah, bro, for sure. Like, I, man, I'm not... I'm one of those people. I'd be... I'd be hyped, you know what I'm saying? Expedition uniform, hatch from, delivery deli bird, Galarian farfetch, farfetched, farfetch leak slapping, a hole, Porygon giving you the eye. Look at him. It kind of looks like he's looking ahead, but he's not. He's giving you the Porygon eye. He's like, hey, I see you looking. Next, Heracross with a single strike, Sobble sobbling on a rock right there, reverse hollow. Oh, no, no, no. And, of course, not a pull from Chilling Rain because that's how this set goes for me. Wouldn't you know, I talk shit about Porygon, so, of course, the holographic evolution of that abomination of a seizure-giving Pokemon right here. Porygon Z has to pop in. That is actually super sick, though. Look at that. Super Beam. Holy shit. Discard two energy cards from this Pokemon. That sucks. I wish I was only one, but still a sick card right there. Thank you, Kindly Laura. Appreciate it. Follow me on IG if you guys don't already. If you guys have the Gram... I got a pretty good method for pulling heat. Is it just like praying to the Pokemon gods for the most ultimate spice? I'm actually stoked about this. We have that already, but... Haunter, please. Yes, I'll take all the Haunters. Oh, we were talking about opinions being like assholes, and I forgot you mentioned the card. Burning was shitty. Oh, yes. And I did get Porygon. <laughs> yes, I did, Brolem. Sucks. It does. All right, bulk with this. These, I'm actually going to... Actually, you know what? No, that Porygon can go over here. It's totally fine. Right there. Shout out Prisma TCG. I almost got a bulk submission together. I'm so stoked to be able to hopefully trade it in for some fun stuff. We'll see exactly how it goes. That pace would whoop me. Wait, which pace? What pace are we talking about? What pace, bro? Tell me what pace. <laughs> Not a big hit, but still a hollow, and the artwork is nice. Skyju, that's exactly it. The background of it is pretty sick. Did you see that the leaked uh, Mew card that's supposedly going to be in one of the upcoming sets today? It looks pretty dope. Yeah, Joseph, we were looking at it last night. We were taking some speculative uh, insight to it. We're going to look again right now as well, too. I'll show you guys for just one second. Um... Let's see if we can get it, guys. Yes, all day Ghastly and Evos are all, all fucking... Oh, for sure. Of course. Um, Let me see... Okay, all right, so we're gonna check this video out here from somebody called uh, Two Canto, T-O-U Canto, um, if it'll go. I gotta pull this down right here. Oh, but your gym sessions today, oh yeah, bro. That was nothing, it's crazy. I shouldn't say it was nothing, I was actually going huge, right? Oh, where's Swolemander? Good question, bro. One second, good call, good call. Good call. That's look it on the mat too. Oh my god, it completes the mat. Let's get it. Um, yeah, man, gains. It was uh, it was pretty hard today, and it was hot as shit. All right, so let's go over here. Okay. 
so I got the volume down because I don't like I want you know copyright purposes and as well too but as you can see here guys and again shout out to two Kanto um, for posting this but you can see kind of sort of uh, not in this photo right here but that's totally okay I wonder if I bounce over here if we can do that nah it's not gonna do it let me see let me see let me try this one guys let me see Nah, I don't have it set up for this tonight because I didn't know if we were gonna be checking it out all right, weighing the packs still work. I make sure my little brolets get the best packs that way. Does it? Nah, I mean, I, I can't because like, I don't know. From my personal perspective, I just don't. I mean, like even getting them, like if I get them myself, it doesn't matter because I'm going to open all my packs regardless, right? <laughs> you know what I mean? But I buy them like from singles. I support my local game shops and stuff, right? So that looks so sick against a mat. Dude, thank you kindly. That Swolemander got to be a pop 1-1. One, one. Bro, I wish it was from the Brolin Poke Games. All right, as you guys can see here, kind of, sort of, we have the Shiny Magikarp. I'm gonna go over here. We have the Shiny Magikarp, we have that Luxray, and we have the Charizard, and of course we have the Rayquaza. I wish it was full, oh, there we go. Bit better of a full screen. Of course, the Charizard coming in here as well, the Shiny Magikarp. I don't know if he's gonna show them you. I'm just gonna pan through, but he's got the pop-ups of some of the cards coming out here as well, too. On top of this Pikachu as well. I think he's doing, just doing comparisons and obviously talking about some details. Let me see here. Old security job just called me to go in. Oh, get it. Is your gym membership, uh, hold on, sorry. Is your gym membership pricey? What happened uh, to the ride fund? Uh, protein or bananas? Uh, pro protein and bananas are still delicious. Um, I'm still waiting on, uh, there's been so many circumstantial things with a car from us like um, going to put a down payment on one and then a company selling it or a business selling it from out underneath of us, going to check a car, going to see a car and then finding out that it's actually sold. A car that came here that we test drove and then we're like, yo, we want this car and then they sold it to somebody else. And then not having a vehicle while you're trying to look for a vehicle is also... A difficult way to go about buying a vehicle so i rented a car for like six days which cost an exuberant amount of money and we went and looked at a lot of different cars but just nothing that was like next vehicle that i get into i'm trying to make sure that i am justifying it with like is it going to run me or run for a reasonable amount of time is it going to be a car that's going to like not give me problems for a significant amount of time for or at least for a little bit of foreseeable future and uh, is it something that i actually like like you know what i mean something that i'm enjoying and it's a bit of an upgrade from what i got last so hopefully soon i've been running everywhere i go man and i think i gotta stop uh, talking about the gym membership man i gotta be able to drive there instead of run there um because yeah it is it's kind of pricey i mean not horrible but protein and bananas are still delicious yes they are i get them in every day i have to absolutely have to yeah the gym ac has been out for four days now it's 88 inside fucking moist yeah bro i wouldn't even mind i'd be like sick i go out into the heat you know what i'm saying because we have like an outdoor area anyway shiny magic carp as you can see guys you got that luxray um where are they here we go this is what some people are going to be obviously super stoked about as you can see big turtle boy right here shout out to danny d he's probably not i don't I, from my personal opinion i know he's gonna fucking hate this card i think that's my that's my personal opinion danny if you're watching i'm just gonna say you hate this card uh venusaur sick we were talking about it last night too guys in my personal poke opinion i think they should have shrunk this logo down like shrunk the 25 down right and they should have put it in the bottom like right hand corner let me see if they pull this actual card up um man the video we were watching from nick's, nick's uh, strength and pokemon he pulled the card up or had a high res image of it but anyway i think they should have pulled this image or the 25 just down a little bit and either put it right here still like that would have been totally fine it was here but just smaller or pulled it down and put him in the bottom right hand side you know what i'm saying but Kanto Kitchen, we made a Poke Fam. Yo, thank you kindly for coming to kick it, man. Appreciate it. Steak and rice, Poke Games. That sounds bomb, bro. Free sauna session. Joseph, that's exactly it, bro. That's exactly it. Um, Bloody Watcher said, hell yeah, these cards are wild. Um, job was trash. Got a new umbrella. Oh, that's got, yo, good stuff, dude. Yeah, expensive rental. Yeah, bro. It, it was an awesome rental. It almost made me get into a Volkswagen, but I was like, no, I will not be, I'll not be swayed. I'm positive uh, those picks leaked are fake. And he said, yo, are, are you? Are you? P like, certain? I've seen speculation, bro. Like, I'm at the point where, like, from the amount of people that have been, like, talking about it and hypothesizing and looking at it and everything, like, I don't know whether these are, like, proxies, like a test print. In my personal... You want my, you want my like, tinfoil hat conspiracy opinion? I think these were, like, leaked. And then the Pokemon company right now is watching everybody's reaction to them. Like, did they like it? Like, is it cool? Do they... What do they think? No? They don't like it? Okay. We'll shrink down this logo and put it somewhere else smaller. You know what I mean? But did I make it at the end again? Polka Kanono? No, bro. No, no, bro. You made it just on time. Uh, for real, I do not like the Pikachu logo. I prefer the Japanese anniversary logo. Not as big. Yeah, exactly. Right. 
and a little bit cleaner you know what i'm saying but yeah andy i i think that it's, a, it's definitely still a possibility we won't know until this sets out right we'll have no idea we know the muse real because it looked like somebody had it in their possession obviously right but again i haven't delved into the super details of it because i'm just involved in so many different aspects and facets things variables a cornucopia a pokey plethora if you if you will of different things within the hobbies and uh sometimes i just i simply just i don't give a fuck about some of the hype you know what i mean i just don't I'm so excited. I'm uh, stoked, obviously, whether these are like real or hy hypothetically not like cool, stoked Venusaur and Blastoise. Give them the reprints. They deserve them. Let me see. Josh, me too, bro. Not a huge fan of 25th stamp. Yeah, not really. I hope they're real. Honestly, I'd rather look uh, them look OG than how the new full arts are. Yeah, I hope they can pay uh, like respects to this. My thing was I said this. Imagine instead of like the like this here. You know what I'm going to do, guys? Really quick. Just one second. One second. I'm gonna go back to it because Nick's Strength and Pokemon had an image of it up, unless I can actually find it on Google. Let me see. Yeah, okay, there it is. Someone had a high res image of it. Okay, you know what? Let's just look at this. This has got lots. Here we go. The EV Hero set number was my fave. It's number 069. Yes. I'm out, y'all. Great stream again, Trey. Bloody Washer. Thank you kindly, Brolem. I appreciate you coming by to kick it like a Hitmon Lee. As always, train on Game On. Stay epic. Stay awesome. And I will catch you on the next one. Pop, pop. All right. So, coming over here and looking at some of these, obviously, you can see the Japanese ones. But, like, see what I mean? Like, the Japanese variation is obviously... Okay, look at this card. That is sick. Don't get me wrong, though. I'm all for reprints. Almighty Albert, I'm right there with you, bro. I'm also totally all for re reprints. Yo, Trace chat coverage is solid as fuck. Buttery smooth. Yo, bloody washer, bro. Thank you kindly, man. That is a compliment and a half. What does Alex Jones think? We should ask Alex Jones and Joe Rogan to have a podcast about this. Um, I always come in at the end. Glad I'm not alone, yo. <laughs> no, not at all. Yo, thank you kindly, man. Appreciate you guys being here. For real. Um, but yeah, Almighty Albert, I love this as well, too. Honestly, like, I am not... I look at this card and I'm like, that is sick. That is still super dope. But this is a Japanese variation. I like this 25th. It looks way cleaner. I like the gold sparkle, but what I said was how they have this in the English variation is that Pikachu head. Instead, they should have just left the full artwork alone. And you know how we had swirls back in the day, right? We had like some dope swirls in the back behind cards and they were always random for the most part. Like, well, they were swirls in the, they should have taken the 25th anniversary and on the hollow thing that they printed on the hollow sheet, they should have just had 25th Pikachu heads as the hollow you know what I mean? As a potential swirl. So like some Venusaurs would have a, you know, a 25th swirl here and some would have a 20 and Blastoise would, you know what I mean? I think that would have been like a cool, like, I just feel like sometimes like the R&D department at Pokemon is just like, all right, who are we going to hire to like really put, all right, let's hire Jim from Digimon and see what he thinks. You know what I'm saying? Third Eye said, Joe Rogan is Oprah for men. Third Eye, you're not wrong, bro. <laughs> but it's also informative and Joe's a fucking boss and a beast for real. Um, the Japanese reprints are sick. I know, bro. I am stoked. Japanese always do it better. Of course they do, Joseph. They most certainly do. We're going to be doing some more Japanese booster boxes on here. Believe it. So, JK Trey, I love JRE. Yo, so do I, bro. But it is. <laughs> the Japanese designs are incredible. Yeah, man. It's insane. It's just so clean. Like, this card, like, I look at this right now, and I'm happy to look at this. Like, that is a, just a boss-looking card. But anyways, as a hypothetical, like I said, what I think they should have done with the English variation is taken the Pikachu head from where it is right here and just kind of like paid that like old school nostalgia respects to like swirls and just on that hollow sheet when it was printed out if that's how it's going down again what the fuck do i know right i literally probably not not i really not that a lot not a lot just not a lot not a lot but they could have had the uh 25th anniversary pikachu head logo in here as kind of like swirls just subliminally on miscellaneous on cards i think that would have been dope but similar to a watermark they could have done a lot more with the hollow pattern exactly bro like i like how it kind of reminds me of like the legendary collection and stuff but yeah yeah the pikachu logo is kind of obnoxious i would have preferred something more low-key exactly man like looking in a binder like i would have liked to have it beside a binder and like obviously as a collector and a proper collector you're gonna know the significant difference between the cards whether it's base set shadowless all that kind of stuff all the different variables of venusaur we'll say hypothetically in this this circumstance but it would have been cool because 
I, I like the fact that it's not so like blatantly a 25th anniversary card. You know what I mean? If it would have been a, just a little bit more subliminal. Now, in my personal opinion, I still prefer this over the Pikachu head. I think it doesn't take away from the art so much. Again, this is just my personal opinion, man. I can take my opinion. I can shove it up my pokey hole, but I'm entitled to it. So I'm going to speak it, you know, to be honest, it looks a lot like a McDonald's hollow. It does, bro. It really does, especially the 25th, bro. Why not just shrink it and put it where old school Watsy set symbols went? Boom, Cosmo. I said the same thing, dude. Not the exact same thing, but I said shrink this down and put it down here. Shrink it down and put it right here. Shrink this down and put it fucking here. I don't know, man. That's just, again, just my personal opinion, but I think a lot of people are going to be in agreement to a certain extent. Are these cards still dope? Fuck yes. Am I still grateful that they reprinted all the... Rhetorical question. Yes, most certainly. But from like a collector's perspective, collectively with a bunch of other collectors... Yeah, that's my personal opinion, but really like the hollow border. Wow, too bad they didn't do uh, do that for English. Yeah, it's not all about Pikachu, right? Like, we get it, man. We For 25 years, we've been eating Pikachu shit. We really understand. We get it. We know. I love the guy. I've been forced to, okay? And I still do. It's Pikachu, bro. I'm glad it wasn't Clefairy at the start. If you guys don't know about that, search that. Clefairy was almost... I'm not picking my nose. I'm adjusting my nose ring. Jeez. Um. Yeah, Clefairy was almost Pikachu kind of sort of yeah totally cool if you like the pikachu logo just not a fan personally yeah that's exactly it bro to each their own this is super dope let's go back over here and see uh hold on to here and i click this click this and i click this here we go and then there was some other stuff here obviously the 25th anniversary collection pack art japanese like that just looks that's so cool that's badass i like that they made pikachu like frowning you know what i mean shrink it and put it where oh andy i said that, like if they shrunk this and they put it maybe in the bottom right hand corner or if they put it right here just in the bottom like or in the right side right here by like the um, description or the weight and the height and all that kind of stuff or like on the english variation if it was like over on this side like just minimal you know and they could have still done the pikachu head and the with the 25 and if you shrink it down like i should edit one so it looks like that you know what i'm saying i hope they do a gen 2 reprint uh whenever the anniversary comes yeah man we were i was and I was talking about that two years ago where it's like, why have they not done XY Evolution style jungle and fossil mixed together? Because the sets were like, obviously XY Evolutions was still a bigger set with all the other additional cards they put into it. And then jungle and fossil were two very small sets. But if you did with them with like, you know, Kabutops EX and GX or whatever, but uh, who knows about that Pika Blue? Ooh, Death Pile. Yo, I like the Pokey lore and like the deep, the, the deep delving. I like this. Pika is over, yeah, I mean, on cards, I think, yes. A, like, Pikachu on a card that's not a Pikachu? Like, come on. I was about to bring up the Pikabulo as well. It's because Wes knows. Cosmo, yes, bro. Like, where they put the base set two or Neo logos went. Yeah, exactly, man. Just, just small, man. At least uh, it's the confetti hollow instead of whatever the shitty current hollows look like. Yeah, I guess. That's very true. Dude, that would be sick. All right, let me see what else we had over here. I wanted to see. Okay. Pack cards, of course, looking sick. If I click on this Mew, it's going to blow it up. Oh, my God. Look at that. I put in the description of this video that we'd be going over some of these singles as well, too. So, I guess that's kind of what we're doing. So, is that Matt you showed for sale and those sleeves? Read. Hold on. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. I'm so glad you asked, Reed. Reed, please hold. Reed, I'm so glad you asked. Are you, are you, are you ready?
there you are my friend i hope that kind of sort of answered your question <laughs> uh link for uh your playmat if you want to check it out uh literally you can hit them up and uh where is it boom you can hit them up right there and be like yo i want a trainer tray charizard playmat give that to me now and they'll be like okay um because i still got to get some other information worked out with them as well too as how to you guys can get that as well uh but you will get 10 percent off if you use the link uh like in the description of this video where's that mew yes the mew is sick deke that video i watched on repeat bro rcs blessed thank you kindly man thank you kindly deke got some insight i sent him some clips while i was editing that just before the stream yo hit up your playmat to get a custom playmat like trey use the code trey yp yo laura laura legendary 10 out of 10 thank you so much rcs bless commercial as hard as oh uh, thank you buckle jeffrey says i wish they would have done more johto pokemon gen 2 like they did base set 2 nope let's slap a huge pikachu head on the cards with no creativity and call it a day i know michael jeffrey sometimes i wish i worked for the pokemon company when it comes to like the research and development of like like how to like put some flavor into some of the stuff like i truly do man like honestly it's unfortunate man but they're like yo you play with leaf energy and say the word fuck so we can't have that we need somebody who has a pearly white smile and can i don't not swear i suppose wasn't it tops called azumarill or meryl pika blue because they didn't know the real name i believe so uh dang i didn't know you had sleeves too yes almighty albert we do i know i'm gonna bounce back over here afterwards you guys can check it out yo what's up freak deek <laughs> i love that yo i dropped a link for you all laura thank you so much appreciate it laura equals legendary best mod most certainly of course all right guys so of course this mew looking awesome as well too but like i said like even the japanese variation or just where the 25th is that looks fine but like man just pull it down and you, it doesn't have to be so obnoxious in my opinion my opinion is not that important but let's see what else we had the pack art and i guess that's it oh just a short little uh a little thing about that right there too all right boom venusaur looking super nice new card cam bouncing back over we still got a pack of modern horizons too we should still get that so we're gonna do it and maybe we'll crack open some pokemon stuff maybe more people at the pokemon company should f with some grass energy maybe they should because maybe some creativity aspects would come into play a little bit more maybe they should f with like other people that are like outside the norm realm you know what i'm saying kanto kitchen says that was a great video thank you kindly we whipped it up like brock in the kitchen real quick and it still came out pretty spicy just as it would if you were Brocking in the kitchen, you know what I mean? Brocking around the kitchen. Free. All right, Modern Horizons 2, let's get it in. I got some Pokemon stuff we might consider cracking into. I'm thinking, in celebration of tonight, I know it's not like that huge of a deal, but like I am super stoked about your playmat again. Big shout out to your playmat. Thank you guys so much, especially Cindy, uh, representative from there that I've been in contact with this entire time, has been absolutely legendary. Just point proven in the sauce. That their customer uh customer base and customer experience is just customer service representation all around i should say is uh top notch top notch you know what i'm saying hey everyone that's really got me sweating bro i'm sweating too probably because it's hot in here though that mu artwork would contend with the southern islands artwork if it didn't have the big 25 on it it would and see what i mean a lot of the cards are going to take away from or it's going to take away from that right you know what i'm saying gotta be polka pg yeah you do almighty albert tavern scoundrel Yes, do some polka packs. We could. Hard evidence. I might. I, in celebration, I'm considering either cracking one single pack, one single sleeved pack of Burning Shadows or XY Evolutions and hunting for a Zard. Or I have an entire Venusaur or Blastoise VMAX box we could crack into. But I was going to use those for a stream tomorrow night where I did Venusaur versus Blastoise. Urban Daggermouth. Vermin Gorger. Guardian Kirin. Floodhound. Terminal Agony. Glimmer Baron. Faithless Salvaging. Come on, we got this Combine Chrysalis. Last pack. Give us something. Give us some something. Power Deep. Oh, let me see. Oh my god, that's not what you want. In my personal opinion, it's not what I want. Oh! Oh! oh. <sighs> Let's go. Last pack magic right there. Let's go. Marsh Flat Slapper. We have something else behind this too, potentially. Can we get something? Tormod's Crypt Keeper Foil. That would have been sick if it would have been like something else big time, but Thopter Token can definitely take a flight. Yo, we're going to check Braid's Cabal Minion, but Marsh Flats is coming around 28 bucks, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, my OCD. Oh, my God. 
Let's see. Okay, yo, uh, let me see. Yo, do we message your playmat directly or search something for the Zard Hunter swag? So we don't, there is no specific link up for it just yet. Um, I wanted to see what the reaction was going to be thus far for it and just kind of like gauge people's like interest and everything. Um, but yeah, you can contact your playmat directly already if you wanted to take preventative or like premeditate like getting it um they, they'll hit you back relatively quickly if you just tell them that like hey this is the code from my friend's youtube channel or just like uh, a content creator's channel that i watch and i want the playmat that they have uh, or the or the sleeves but yeah soon i'm gonna have my own like personal link and everything and it'll be set up so you guys can super scoop super scooping up for yourselves and i'll be able to like advertise and it'll be awesome let me see that's pretty optimistic thinking there joe which wait what only thing i think about uh the pikachu 25 symbol is kids that got the cars from mcdonald's are gonna love it and could create future nostalgia that is very optimistic but i do like it <laughs> joe and joe joe and joe with the optimism yo that's very true though evo zard hunt mm, almighty albert it's possibility i have the problem of always wanting to open evolution so do i bro and it's a problem to the point where i am down to under 10 sleeved blisters if you guys know how many we've had over time how many we've given away how many we've cracked open i am down to under, i think i'm at, at eight or nine uh xy evolution sleeve blisters and they're the only the zard pack artworks i don't even have a play set of the artworks anymore so uh trey is a friend hey guys <laughs> our friend trey yo just say that be like yo this guy has so many friends it's so nice no idea what i'm looking at but cool tetra i will show you we'll bounce over here right now and uh just give you some insight into some of the like values of just some common rares into magic the gathering in magic the gathering or some sets so i shouldn't even say common it's we've been pulling them quite decently um modern horizons 2 has been treating us really 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 good but march flat's coming in around 28 bucks in just the regular rare variation which is exactly what we pulled and uh we're gonna check out the braids cabal minion i don't think it's anything but yeah no it's nothing at all whatsoever thought so freaky as fuck look at this imagine that tickling your toes in the middle of the night you wake up kicking at the end of the bed you're like oh are my feet what is that and just braids cabal minion he's like mm -hmm. <laughs> you didn't wash your feet so scary man freaky deaky look at that do all the fire do the fire burning shadows yo we definitely could we could rock the burning shadows brian what is going on man thanks for coming to kick it legendary gentleman appreciate you being here 32 legendary type cardboard connoisseurs pack cracking tcg fanatics if you guys wouldn't mind mega punch shit out of the like button please and thank you I remember that card that's a reprint yes yes it is yes it is brolem yes it is uh to be honest i'm all for um i'm all for everything i've seen for all the upcoming pokemon shit tcg and video games i'm just hype in general can't complain mud pie mud pie that is the sum of it all right there that is the sum of it all to be honest i'm all for everything i've seen for all the upcoming pokemon shit tcg and video games related i'm just hype in general and can't complain yo Not all of them, Joe. Yo. Deke just dropped a $90 donation and said three Zard Hunter playmats on me for the legendary chat. You choose the winners. Keep killing it, bro. And don't forget the code. <laughs> Yo, would you imagine? You imagine I forget my own code? You imagine I forget my own code, bro? That'd be insane. Shifty Dragon that says, yo, yo, trainer, trainer, my poke up peeps. What is on the menu today? Well, my friend, we are just doing a uh, little review of the mats that we've gotten in recently. I'm going to drop a, uh, the commercial video so you guys can see it again. And speaking of which, I'm going to take a second here to compose myself. Deke, thank you so much, bro. That is insane. And then when I come back from this commercial, I'm going to tell you guys exactly how, if you guys are interested, uh, you can win one of these Zard Hunter play mats courtesy of the Brolem Polka Deke and uh your playmat i suppose but primarily polka deke so yo check this out shifty dragon this is uh you asked what was up tonight this this is exactly this is this is what was up tonight bro let me i went to do that really quick and then this this is what's up tonight i gotta find it where the fuck is it there it is i found it
Boom. Friendos. Put some slappers back on. Yo, someone said change the screen. <laughs> Yo, you didn't like that screen, bro? Hold on. You didn't like that You didn't like looking at this? Can I blow this card up some more? Let's look at it. Oh, you don't like this? Bro, come on. Look at it. Look at her. Look at her eyes, bro. Just at the end of the bed tonight, you're like, when you think your feet, it's a cold breeze just tickling your feet. It's not. It's really the cabal minion. You didn't wash your feet, Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> so scary. All right. Back to business. Come on here. I want to see who uh, who's going to drop some fire in the chat. Yo, what I'm going to do, guys, is uh, for the people that are here tonight who came here just to support and be awesome, whether you guys knew this is what we were doing or not, regardless, and uh, because the gentleman Deke has done so right here live with us, what we're going to do is we're going to do a giveaway for these or this mat or one of these mats tonight for one of them. Two other positions on here, I'm going to do or I'm going to incorporate them for a giveaway on IG so I can also like tag your playmat in it as well too. Uh, get some more other legendary type trainers out there for them to at least check this mat out as well and probably utilize like the commercial as well too because they put a lot of time into it. So I think that would be awesome. Deke, if you're cool with that, you will rock two that way and we'll rock one tonight for you guys and uh, we'll go that way. She looks like that chick from Mad TV. She looks like... Nah, she looks like scary. Trey, you should make that braids card into a playmat, bro. It probably is. It probably is, bro. I can only imagine. Freaky Deaky. And speaking of Freaky Deaky, Deek. Thank you kindly, Brolem. I'm sure everybody in the chat is absolutely stoked. And we're going to do that tonight. We're going to do it. I want to win a mat. I want to win a mat. We're going to do that, guys. So, mmm, mmm-hmm. Bro. Deke drops another $40 donation and says, I've caught, can't forget the sleeves, bro. Think this covers one winner. Yes, it does. Bro, thank you kindly. And then Zard lurking, bro. Come on. Bro. Dude, some bananas and strawberries. I wish I had some fruit right now. I use the last, I have frozen strawberries, uh, but I use the last of my organic bananas um, for, I didn't know the difference. I picked them up. I'm like, right, these, I guess are fine. Um, use the last of my bananas for a shake today, bro. Zard lurking. Arceus Bless, man. Thank you so much, dude. Gentleman. That magic card is better looking than my... Oh! She's not that bad looking. She's, she's braids. is nice. Mudpie says, let's go. Je Deke with the generosity as usual. I mean, what? Literally. You have no idea. No idea. Um, yeah, But yes, of course. 2019, that's me at 3 a.m. on my 69th coffee. Oh, my God. Look at those CGI special effects. That was special effects. Special O-ring effects. Did any of those go? Did any of those go? I didn't see if any of them actually hit the camera decently. I tried to aim them that way, but... Okay, cut me off. You're cut, bro. Deke, you're cut. Stop it. Stop. Stop your cut. Zard lurking as a spicy avatar. Yeah, he does, bro. It's badass. You see it's holding the two? Bro, that's... That is super spice. Zard lurking, thank you so much, bro. Sup? Chilling like Krillin, my friend. Hey, bro, I'm finally here. Birdman Productions. Thank you kindly for coming to kick him, man. So, guys. Um, let me see. How I'm going to do this. Now, nah, we'll wait. We'll wait. We're going to do the giveaway for it. We're going to wait a little bit. I'm going to grab another box to crack and you guys let me know what or what we should do. I'm going to grab a couple things and then you guys can let me know. All right, so would I, Zard Lurking, so would I, 100%. Good coffee is key. Those custom sleeves, though, Canto Kitchen, thank you kindly. Yes, 
you guys haven't seen them up close again just yet they are mighty fine and the best part about these as well too i find a lot of sleeves and again guys um it, just so you know as well too the sleeves that i ordered it's not like they're bad just a, a, a slight miscommunication um the ones that i ordered had like a tattered border on the inside so if you guys do get the zard sleeves or uh even for some of the winners or one of the winners i will uh, make sure that they have them on the inside like that because yeah that's uh too much but the best part about these is that they fit because these cards also have the perfect fit on them as well too right so it's just nice that they're um like perfect fit inside of these sleeves as well too for the added protection so super nice what i um typically what you could do or what's a better option too if you really want to protect them inside of a sleeve like this i know this is a varied opinion and everyone's entitled to their opinion i do this sometimes uh but if you take the card and you put this one in this way and you put Again, people say like this bounces the card around and stuff like that as well too, but again, to each their own. Wait, what am I doing here? Do I have this right? No, I don't. It's like I don't know what I'm doing or something. Please hold. There we go, there we go. I'm all kerfuffled and upside down and stuff. Oh, I can't even get it with my shades on. I can't see what I'm doing, there we go. Boom. Put it upside down, now there's no dirt getting in there at all whatsoever, you know what I'm saying? Those sleeves are quite spiffy. Thank you kindly. Sup, bird man? That's what I like to see, man. Chilling like Krillin, as we all usually are. Anyway, those off to the side. Okay. These are our options, friendos. These will we'll rock tonight, okay? This is like a celebratory thing. Like, I'm never going to do this ever again, for real, because I don't have any left. So, we could do one of these. Or we could do one of these. Or, we could do one of these, that way I can scoop another one so I can still have them both. And I can also put one more of these jams on. There we go. Or we could do one of these bad boys. I know that seems like counterintuitive when I have Charizard stuff, but I really want one of those sleeves out of here, so we'll see how it goes. Turtle? Turtle or thick green plant guy? And then you guys let me know. Yes! Don't worry, I'm still waiting. Hopefully, guys, all is well with your kid as well, too. Let me see. What else did I miss? Yo, Kanto Kitchen saying Zard Hunt, Rainbow Zard Hunt. I should hold my beer. I will. Pass it over, bro. Can't say I won't take a sip. Eobar says Burning Shadows, save the boxes. Which one has your favorite Zard? Um, I, I will never pull a Rainbow Rare Charizard, even though that's what we continue to hunt for. I've hunted this card for uh, years now, literally fucking years, since Burning Shadows booster boxes were like 120 bucks and never ever pulled it. Um, XY Evolutions, I love obviously the Reverse Hollow and Holographic and Mega Charizard out of here. I'm really fond of just the regular Charizard EX out of XY Evolutions. I love that card. Um, Jabroni Josh is making the right decision out of everything, saying, I say keep all of them sealed, Trey. Yes, definitely. Maybe open Burning Shadows. <laughs> I mean, maybe. We could still go Zard hunting in these boxes too, though, because there is a Darkness Ablaze inside of there, so it's still a little bit of Zard hunting, which isn't too, too bad. Yeah, keep them sealed. The pulls are 99.99% doo-doo. I know they are, bro. Poke Padre saying Burning Shadows. Uh, let me see. Save the boxes for tomorrow's stream, says Kanto Kitchen. That might be a good idea as well. Yeah, Trey, maybe good thing you didn't read my last comment. Why? What did you say, bro? Do I probably not want to? <laughs> ruthless joe yes I, I don't want to read it out loud but i read it yes nice i mean for the blastoise venusaur boxes oh got you oh yeah man they're super nice too you know what i mean actually andy is right yes keep them sealed the pulls are 99 percent probably for sun and moon and these bad boys is that your sam that's what i thought rainbow zard is waiting for you in that burning shadows pack is it wes is it in this one wes how certain are you bro Wes, how certain are you that there's a, a rainbow rare Charizard waiting in that pack? Let's see. Ooh. Oof. Oof, no, we can't do that one. Open them all, says Smack Daddy. <laughs> Smack Daddy, I like the way you think. I really like the way you think, bro. Yo. Should we go hard tomorrow? 
Yo, he is 100%. <laughs> Kanto Kitchen's just like, actually, let me speak on his behalf and let me. I want to see that open. So he is 100% certain. Yo, should we go hard tomorrow and open an OG Hidden Fates tin? Could you imagine, bro? I, I don't know. Open an OG Hidden Fates tin, open a Blastoise box, open a Venusaur box. And then just be like, yo, Charizard versus Blastoise versus Venusaur. Open them all and, and give nothing back. Just rip it all. Rip it all. I should, bro. Um, I opened a couple of those boxes to get the promos, but the pulls are not that good. I know I kind of want the promos, but yeah, those boxes, the pull rates suck ass. Basically paying for the promos and the sleeves are actually really nice. They are super nice, but Laura's like, hard, yes, no trade, don't do it. Jabroni Josh, bro. I love everybody here, man. You guys are all so fucking awesome. I love everyone that's like, rip it. Rip it all right now. No re no regrets. Just rip it all. Oh, look, Pokemon Snap in the background. Rip it all. No regrets. Just fucking do it. And then I love everybody else that's like, don't do it, Trey. Don't do it. Be smart with your collection, bro. Don't rip any of it. And just be a smart gentleman. You don't got to rip it for us. We can just hang out and have fun. We could rip digital packs, you know? And then everybody else is like, don't rip it. But rip it. But rip all of it. But don't open all of it. But rip all of it every last bit hidden stonks yo could be laura see there you go <laughs> jeffrey yo thought he was gonna pull out some sushi again <laughs> that was so random last night i knew i wanted to trip everybody out of like i had it there i'm like oh by the way this sushi here <laughs> no regrets, yo, Laura. <laughs> mm, Hidden Fate Skyju says, open everything. You guys are legitimately the best, man. Yeah, just hang out and have fun, Joe says. Yeah, just just hang out and have fun, bro. I mean, I, like, don't open any packs or anything, bro. <laughs> oh, dude. Think about Josh. Yo, Josh. All right. For the culture, I'm thinking about the stonks. Oh, <laughs> Don't rip it. Rip it. Rip it now. Do it. Rip that Burning Shadows pack open right now. I don't know why. It's Christian Bale Batman. Boy, you better rip the pack open right now. Rip it open. <laughs> well. Yo, what's up, nice game mat, yo? Hey, man, thanks for asking. And by the way, before we open up that Burning Shadows game mat, just because Jeff mentioned it, every person that comes in here tonight and says, nice game mat, I'm literally just going to do this. I love you guys so much. Please enjoy. gotta find a uh, stream starting soon wow am i gonna get it <laughs> found it my eyes got their cardio for the day yo did you guys like that christian bell batman for sure nice game matt thanks Birdman. you guys want to watch a commercial real quick i don't know if i showed you guys yet let me just show you this commercial no i'm just joking totally joking chill sirs <laughs> Everyone had uh, different opinions on that voice right there. I was going for Christian Bale Batman. I usually can do it better, but I'm calling it now. I'm gonna pull a Taros from Burning Garbage. Yo, Tetra, you're probably totally right. I can only imagine. 36 legendary type cardboard connoisseurs in here. Appreciate you guys. The Snorlax size shit ton. If you please wouldn't mind mega punching the like button, hyper beam it, drop kick it, whatever you want to do to it, please do it. And then click the notification bell. Ring it like the Hunchback of Notre Dame. Quasimodo, please do it. Go for it. Every 10 minutes on repeat. Encore. 
Are you finna use that as a mouse pad anime tray? I'm gonna get a longer one because you can get a longer one and I'm gonna do it a little bit different. Um, what I would like to do is get one like this with the, uh, um, like where it has a square things for the cards on it. When I'm live streaming, can have cards that are like decent hits and stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be working with them in a cool capacity. It's really, uh, yeah, there'll be more to come. I don't like talking about stuff until I do it from now on. So that's what I'm gonna do. Yo, Laura is a legendary last to contact your play, Matt. Drop them an email, let them know you're interested in Trey Zard, Matt. And here is the email. Thank you so much, Laura. Don't forget to mention the discount code. There it is right there. And guys, we are giving away one of these play mats tonight. And we're gonna be giving away two other of these other play mats. One of those is gonna be combined with the pack of sleeves. And we're gonna be doing that on IG. And we're gonna rock it like Brock and Onyx. And again, that is big thanks to Deke for popping in tonight and being a legendary fucking Brolum and just being like, yo, Polka pay it forward as usual, man. So thank you again, guys. If you didn't see, I'm going to drop a replay on that again. Just because like, come on, bro. Yo, three Zard Hunter play mats on me for the legendary chat. You choose the winners. Keep killing it, bro. Don't forget the code. Crazy, man. Sound like bad from, from Hishi. What is that? I want to know what that is. Guys, we did it. We ripped into this for the culture, for you guys, for the celebration tonight. We're going to pull a Shino tick out of here. That's my prediction. We're going to hit the Shino tick. If you pull Taros, I'm going to donate one more bundle. <laughs> If I pull Shino Tick, I'm gonna punch through my lens right here, right through there. Boom! And uh, that's what we'll do. Let's go. Yeah, I'm glad you guys like that. Yo, this is for you guys for real right here. I wouldn't be able to do this kind of stuff without you guys. We wouldn't have these mats and this kind of shit without you guys. This wouldn't be a live stream. There wouldn't be companies contacting me being like, yo, we wanna like hook you up with it. Like, you know what I mean? There wouldn't be that without you guys. So again, for real, from the bottom of my little, little shriveled up little organ inside that's beating thank you guys a snorlax size shit ton i love you and i'm so stoked to be able to poke pay forward to you guys thanks to deke for real as well plumeria cedra how it should have ended it's a pretty funny channel right just smash it out here we go wah buffet sandy gast we got a venipede sneasel alolan vulpix just kind of want to slow it down. I want to slow roll it. You know what I mean? I appreciate all the cards from Burning Shadows. I should keep the bulk. Yeah, there we go. Let's go. Because I'm Batman. Because I'm Batman. Where's the trigger? Horsey. Reverse hollow Porygon's you later. Come on. Let's go. Let's get this. Let's get this. Let's get this. Are you ready? Tertinator! Quickly now! It is Tertinator! Look out, everyone! Laura! Let's get some fire, at least. I do like that Sneasel artwork. I do. I do like that Sneasel artwork. It's pretty sick. We're gonna focus on that. That Sneasel? Sneasel? Wait, Sneasel? Wait, what Sneasel? Man. Well... <laughs> We didn't quite pull a Charizard. Guys, did you see the Charizard we just pulled from Burning Shadows? Wow, I'm glad I kept that pack sleeve for the longest time. I'm gonna put these magic hits off to the side. At least the magic packs were slappers. And the Yu-Gi-Oh! The Yu-Gi-Oh! single pack was spice. We'll take it. Anyway. That's how it goes. For the culture. Friendos. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna poke a pay forward to you guys. Because that's how it goes around here. Thanks to the legendary Brolem. Now. What I have to do is go over here and find it. Come on. Porygon won't go away. Yo, tonight he is. He is quite literally a reoccurring Pokemon popping up from the wild. This is uh, like, there we go. Just my OCD of how straight this has to be. I know it has to do with the camera too, but that's much better. There we go. There we go. Yo, thank you kindly, Laura. Appreciate it. All right, guys. Time. For who's that Pokemon guessing game giveaway tonight, my friends? We're going to be giving away one of these right here, right here. This this mat, this mat right here. We're gonna be giving it away to one of you guys. Um, I'm gonna have to custom order it, and then I'm gonna have to get it shimped to you, or sh shrimped to you. <laughs> I read simp, <laughs> and then for some, for some reason shrimp and shipped. You guys fucked me up all kinds of ways. There we go. I'm back. Had to put the kiddo to bed. Third eye. Thanks for coming back to kick it, Brolem. I hope they went down easy. I know that could be difficult at young ages for sure. Friendos, we're gonna do another Who's That Pokemon guessing game giveaway, which means I need an energy card. So please hold, because I didn't anticipate doing such. Yes. And 
gonna go on a fire energy of course right here if you guys don't know how this works what we're going to do is i'm going to take this energy card and i'm going to walk over wait 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 there i'm going to walk over there where i have two pokemon boards with all original from gen 1 and gen 2 pokemon on them i'm going to pick gen 1 a gen 1 pokemon only when i walk over there i'm going to write that pokemon's name down on this card right here and then i'm going to take this card and i'm going to stick it in my hat and we're going to play some fucking Pokus Charades to a certain extent. Free shrimping with purchase. Mmm, shrimping so good. Deke, do they have it? Bro, imagine if they made a Where's Waldo but Pokemon. You could just grab a page and, and digitally hide a Zard for them to find on IG. <gasps> Bro. Huge idea. That's crazy. Someone orders a custom from the chat right now. I'll donate half of the trade right now. Bro, that is crazy. Third eye. Bro. You guys are too much, man. We're just giving one away right now. You guys are insane. All right. Give me one second. I'm going to walk over there. Oh, I didn't even finish explaining because you guys are just too kind, man. And trip me out as I'm trying to read the chat here. I'm going to write a Gen 1 Pokemon's name down on here. Gen 1 and Gen 1 Pokemon only. When I come back here and I have this card in my hat, when I say go, and only when I say go, please and thank you. When I say go, 3, 2, 1, go is what I will say. This time doesn't count. At that point in time, I want you guys to guess Gen 1 Pokemon one at a time first person to guess the pokemon that i have written down on here correct is going to win themselves one of these mats courtesy of your play mat courtesy of pokedeek and courtesy of whatever i have to do to get it to you as quickly as possible <laughs> need that book or books asap bro i need that right now pronto as well too i want to paint some pokemon third eye yo dude what could you paint Let's see you paint a scyther scyther all right friendos give me a second we're gonna rock it Wait, wait, while that's happening, guys, while I'm thinking of a Pokemon to write down, I just I wonder I just wanted to know if you guys happen to see a If I'm not back in five minutes, just wait longer. Hey guys, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate every single one of you. I have a Pokemon card in my hat right there. Uh, cheers, three, two, one, go. Hey, third eye gentleman right there. His eyes are sweating, not crying, yo. <laughs> Or some shades in time before I roll it again. I'm going to roll it right now. All right, here we go. Train on, game on. Stay epic, stay awesome. Thank you kindly. I try. Joe says Charizard. Drowsy. Bill Cosby, favorite Pokemon. Rapidash, Mock. Yo, Cubone, Eevee, Raichu, Caterpie, Danny Stoyce, Onyx right there. Um, let me see. Loyal Logic, what is going on? Thanks for coming to kick it. No cap, I might have to get one. Yo, thank you kindly. Uh, Pico, oh, I got to go through this really quick right here. Hold on, let me see. No one said it. Oh my god, there's so many guys. You guys are insane. Vulpix, Charizard, Arbok, Charizard, Eevee, Arcanine, Kabutops. No, Scyther. Pikachu, Muck, Abra, Porygon, Charmeleon, Vaporeon, Pinsir, Ponyta, Grimer, 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 uh, Galarian, Weezing, Kabuto, Charizard, Taros, Machop, Porygon, Taros, Farfetch, Raichu, Rapidash, Staryu, Machop, Machamp, Coughing, Haunter, Coughing, Squirtle, Mr. Mime, Blastoise, Gengar, Mewtwo, Charabaka, Blissey, no. 
Oh, Gen 1 only, Brolem. Uh, Ninetales, Steelix, Cubo, Mew, Rhyhorn, Weezing, Abrataro, Zapdos, Aerodactyl, Charmeleon, Electabuzz, Pikachu, Bellsprout, Zapdos, Magmar, Jinx, Gyarados, Ghastly. <laughs> That's an Electabuzz. Tangela, Articuno, Vulpix, Moltres, Haunter, Mewtwo, Weezing, Hadouken, Charmander, Growlithe, Moltres, Ivysaur, Drowsy, Gengar, Articuno, Jinx, Beedrill. It's slowing down a bit. This is good. Lapras, Rowlet. Nope, not quite. That's uh, that's different. No, Armor, Mewtwo. I love that. Magnemite, Caterpie, Arcanine, Ghastly, Anime Tray, Ekans, Rattata, Kabuto, War Turtle, Hypno. I can't believe no one is guessing. Let's Electabuzz again. Mew, Mew. Uh, Bulbasaur, Jinx, Caterpie, nope, mm -mm. nope, none of those yet, Weezing, Ivysaur, Voltorb, Lapras, Seal, slowing down a little bit, this is nice, Ghastly, Alolan, Ninetales, now Dragonair, Zapdos, Weedle, Pinsir, Ivysaur, Lickitung, Lick Gang, Licky Licky, Haunter, Magmar, Mr. Mime, Kakuna, Dratini, Arbo Gloom, no, Onix, Haunter, this is a lot, Arnold, Lal, quickly now, pick a Pokemon, Tentacruel, Goldeen, Voltorb, Gloom, Pidgey, Hypno, Marowak, how is no one guessed this, Cloyster, Seeking, Charabaka, Pidgeot, Tentacle, Seal, Hitmonlee, Metapod, I don't remember, Pidgeot, Butterfree, Dragonite, Mewtwo, Mr. Mime, Weeping Bell, really, no one is gonna guess this, holy shit, let's go, Hitmonchan, Beedrill, Farpetch, no, Moltres, no, no, Onyx, Kangaskhan, Dratini, no one has said this Pokemon yet, I can't believe no one has said it, let's see, Clefable, Dugong, Squirtle, Lickitung, Chari, no, Clefairy, Vileplume, Kabutops, Spiro, Flareon, Pikachu, Female, Flareon, no one has said this, it's crazy, yo, the other night someone guessed it, first Pokemon right off the hop, first Pokemon off the hop, this is like 800, Kingler, I'm just going through, I can see, Venusaur, Metapod, no, Gyarados, no, Butterfree, no, 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 Machamp, no, come on, somebody's gotta get this, think, yo, the Pokemon that's gonna help you out, Ooh, mud pie getting it right there yo right there mud pie chancy chancy bye bye yeah she's butterfree friendos we have got a winner winner chicken dinner right there you guys can stop guessing right now the winner is mud pie finally guessing a chancy bro i cannot believe no one guessed chancy chancy ammonite squirtle squad squirtle Mewtwo, Ekans, Metapod, Andy. What did Andy say? Andy says Swolmander, yo. <laughs> Let's go. People are still guessing. People are still guessing. Letting it roll. Letting it roll. But yo, Mud Pie. Good stuff, man. Last, I should say, but just good stuff in general. <laughs> like, I drew the Pokeball on there. I was doing it while the, the commercial was on the roll. Birdman Vidar saying, stop. Is it Chansey? I bet it's Ch I bet I think it's Chansey. Is it Chansey? Yo, dropping the stop seal. Thank you kindly. Appreciate it. Laura with the hand. Yo, I like it. Bleed teal with the stop as well, too. There. Got to think outside the box. Yes. Yo, good stuff, Mud Pie. Wait. Oh my God. Yo, you deserve it. Legendary last. Thank you so much. For real. That was a marathon, bro. I was usually I read absolutely every single one of them, but like, yeah, it's uh, that was hard. There's they, they would come in like clumps, too. So I'm like reading. It's nice and slow. And it's just like 90 Pokemon at one time. I'm like, all right, well, I got this. Let's get this. GG. Yes. Mud Pie. Thank you. Congratulations, guys. Give a big congratulations to Mud Pie. Well deserved. Always here. Always supporting so many people's channels. Literally, you see Mud Pie in every content creator's live stream, and it is friggin' amazing. It is amazing. It's the most beautiful Pokeball I've ever seen. Thanks. Kind of looks like a. Yeah. <laughs> Such good fun. Great game. Thanks for the fun, Deke. Treasure Jacqueline. Thank you kindly as well, too, for always being here and spreading that positive energy. Mud Pie. Hit me up. Hit me up on IG. I'll make it easier for you as well, too. Just contact me via IG. I already have your shipping information. I uh, sent you... I, yeah, you got those mud pie. Those uh, mud kips. Yes. All right. Let's go. That's too much. That was a lot. My throat's on fire. Hey, friendos. Have you guys seen a commercial, a commercial that I did? I don't know if you guys seen... No, I'm just joking. We haven't done that. We're not going to do that again. But what we are going to do, friendos, what we are going to do... Oof. Oh, I want to do it. I just want to do it. I want to do it to prove it wrong. Hey, need my shades. <laughs> Thanks, Deacon. Good job, Mud Pie. Yes, congratulations, Mud Pie, with the Raichu guess. Also, someone had to say it for me. I thought, was it Raichu? Was it? There you go, Deacon. For real, that was. Yeah, there we go. Let's go. Drink some H2O homostasis, bro. I have honestly, I think I've overhydrated today. Um, man, I, yeah, a lot. I don't even know. Crack more Pokemon? Guys, 
Drop the leaf energy in the chat. If I get more than 10 people that say crack this, we'll do it for the culture right now. This will be the last thing we crack tonight. Like I said, I was going to do it on last night's, or yeah, the live stream for tomorrow night. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll do it. We'll do it. Actually, you know what? Oh. All right, friendos. <laughs> Rip it tomorrow. That's what I'm going to do. I am going to save those for tomorrow. I'm going to make that the stream for tomorrow in case I'm unable to grab anything. And uh, we're going to do it that way. But what I will do, guys, is these are the options. And I will leave it up to you guys right now. We will do one of these 100% because we got to. I'm celebrating tonight a little bit. I'm excited. I'm extremely grateful that we have the opportunity and the ability even to give away some stuff to you guys tonight as well, too. Um, so let's do this. All right. Here we go. Here we go, friendos. And the first poll of the night, we're going to get it in. I want to see the Mega Charizard. Guys, well, there it is right there. We're going to leave the options for you guys. We have a pack of Darkness Ablaze. We have a pack of Unbroken Bonds. These are the uh, promo packs. This is stuff I've kept sealed, man. This is coming out of my, like, personal sealed collection. So, uh, like I said, man, any product has been super hard to super scoop up around here if it's not Chilling Rain or Battle Styles. Um, some Vivid Voltage, I was able to grab a pack today, but like even that. So we have the Darkness of Blaze Pikachu promo right there. We have the Unbroken Bonds uh, Pikachu and Coin promo right there with the Poplio coin. Or, man, this might pain, but it might be gain, yo. We could rip the uh, XY Evo Mega Charizard pack artwork right there. Let me see. Let's see. But I want to see something else too. Hold on. Oh my god, that's crazy. Oh, that's better. Okay. I knew it. I knew I had one. I knew I had another one, so I could do the EV one if we would get the Unbroken Bonds vote, which I'd be way more stoked to do. Love that Pika promo, yes. Is that the Darkness of Blaze Danny wanted you to open and you said no? Probably. Probably. Uh, the Pika promo with Unbroken Bonds is worth a pretty penny. Oh, yo, I thought so. And it's got the Zard pack artwork on it as well, too. So, yeah, we'll just do this real quick. We'll just whoopsies. swap that out right there just like that. I want to see the Mega Charizard. If you ever get a cool grass type chase card, we have to make Leaf Energy Wall. Ooh, Bleed Tail. I love that idea. That would be sick. Unbroken Bonds is my vote. All right, guys. I want to see what the vote is. Roll a D20. If you get a one, it's all three packs. All right, done. Yo, third eye. Oh my God. That's disgusting. If I get a one, yo, this is the Modern Horizons oversized D20. One in 20 chance, yo. <laughs> Third Eye said, roll a D20. I'm a, bro, how much of a nerd, how much of a fucking nerd on you when someone randomly in a chat is like, yo, roll a D20 and just within instantaneous on hand, I can grab two D20s quicker than I can grab my own Ultra Balls. You know what I'm saying, bro? That's some nerd status shit right there. You know what I'm saying? Flex on us real quick with the seal collection tray. Bleed Teal there, it is nothing, it is no trust, bro. Trust when I say it is not a flex. I'm right now. I'm I'm, I'm pulling up some of my seal collection, bro <laughs> Yes, let's go. All right. I'll roll the d20. Well, you think I'm scared Brolem? You think I'm scared? Check this out. Oh my god. I am scared. I'm scared to roll this. What the fuck? <sighs> oh It's off camera. It's a six. It's a oh you can see you can see look 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 Pulling it as is right there 
Woo! Bro, my heart rate went up. My heart rate went up straight up, bro. <laughs> I felt it. I was like, oh shit, son. I didn't roll it the first time because I was legit scared. Man, I've been less scared to roll a pair of die in a back alley with a bunch of people I don't know with money on the line than I was right there just like that, yo. <laughs> Truth. All right, friendos. Thank you guys for real so much for coming to kick it on a late night legendary live stream. Appreciate you guys for my so much. Just too much, man. 5% chance. That was that's too much of a chance in my opinion anyway. Mm. Mm hmm. Bro, it's still better than mine. Trust I'm clinging on to one pre-release box. I still seal. Yo, hang on to it, bro. Hang on to it and love that box. Or rip it. It's entirely up to you. Straight up sweating. I am. <coughs> he meant six, not one, yo. <laughs> For all packs. All right. Let's see this vote. Friendos, I asked you guys, my community here tonight on the Late Night Legendary live stream, I asked, presented a question. Which one is getting ripped, Kadabra? XY evolutions for the culture? Or to break those bonds open, right meowth? Or to set the darkness ablaze? And, you guys voted XY evolutions for the culture. So you know what we're gonna do? We're going to, uh, we're gonna do XY Evolutions for the culture, but just before we do that, I just wanna know if you guys have seen a commercial I did today. I don't know if you've seen it. Thanks, Bleed Tail. Bleed Tail, it said, Trey, when you zoom in, it shows your chair and not your face. I know, bro. It just shows my side profile. It's kind of like a, like when I'm back out here, it's like, oh, hey, what's going on? And then when I zoom in here, it's not really me, but it is me. You know what I mean? It's more or less just like you're hearing, you know, you know, you do, do you know, do you know what I'm saying? Is it just me or does anyone else hear Trey typing? Yeah, I was, I was typing. I didn't turn the microphone off because sometimes man when you're doing like you have 93 things going at one time you're you're bound to like i'm like tr i'm monitoring the battery of this light life right here i'm making sure that the this light, light right here is good making sure my computer is running reasonably the youtube connection is going Streamlabs isn't fucking up my kilobytes per second rate is reasonable i'm making sure the music volume levels are reasonable checking the polls to make sure i'm ripping open this pack of xy evolutions right here which by the way this is exactly what we're going to be ripping out yes rub that charizard belly of course and then you're also taking into consideration everybody in the chat i'm trying to keep up with that as well too i'm glad the sleeves don't have gross matte font uh front so you can actually see the cards i know that's another bonus right they're nice and clear and see you know what i mean like obviously my light's not reflecting off them which is another thing i'm always taking into consideration um it's they're clean and they're nice you know what i mean 92 things is easy 93 though yeah no bro fuck that as soon as i get to 93 things i just quit shut the stream off you know what i'm saying gets to be too much deke is gone again his eyes are wet guys somebody get him some sunglasses jay trisha what is going on legendary last thank you kindly for coming to kick it yo hello yo. jay i just want to ask you a question i just want to know have you seen a commercial that i did by jay? <laughs> everybody's like if he fucking plays this commercial one more time tonight i'm going to poke a snap pokemon snap to contact your playmat yo to contact your playmat, please contact them here. I said contact twice. Yo, thank you kindly. Matt front is so dumb. Like, why? I just don't, I like, some of them I'm like, okay. But like, I just, yeah. It takes away from like the whole purpose of the card, right? I don't know. I don't know. Some people like the aesthetic. It is what it is. It is what it is. Yo, dude. Bro.
Yo, Michael Jeffrey dropping a $20 super chat, $21 super chat, bro. Trey can, dude. Put that mop back right away real quick. Yo, man. Fucking thank you guys for real, man. Yo, Trey, congrats on everything today. Let's celebrate with not one, but another XY from your seal collection, Brolem. Woo! Dude, you gotta do one more play, bro. One more right at the end. Yo, J Trisha said hit me with it though, so we gotta see it. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna figure out what other Yeah. Michael Jeffrey, bro. Thank you so much, dude. Arceus bless. Fucking gent, man. Thank you, dude. Dead ass serious. Thank you. Okay, uh, Jay Trisha, I just, I don't know, you see, I, I know some people might have seen this commercial already, but I just, I'm gonna play it out again anyway, and anybody catching the replay is gonna be like, holy fuck, I've watched this commercial 19 times already, hey, check it out. shakalaka it's like the 19th time i've played it i think i think i'm even getting tired of it already i, I can't hear the audio of the th when i watch it i don't hear the audio and the sound effects and everything right if you guys don't know like the sound engine design that i do on videos is like man i go in <laughs> but anyway jay trisha thank you kind of get yo deeks <laughs> sorry ha had to go squeegee my eyes comes back videos playing again damn it getting ready for work so let's start the day right yo thank you kindly jay appreciate it gonna be having dreams of this video tonight bro me too man especially from the amount of frustration that went into it today jay you're having tea and a full english breakfast before work Ooh, dreams dreams all right jeffrey my friend as much as i on if i had what i have for xy evolution still i would crack another xy evo this is a big deal for me which is i know is crazy to say and like i have no shame in saying that at all whatsoever but like man i don't have an insane collection right the rest of them i am 100 keeping sealed but however that does not mean that i will not take away from that dono and crack open this check lane blister which i know is like it's still a zard hunting ticket so we're gonna go in it sounds like this. Do, 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 do. It does. Do, do, do. It's not, that's kind of like Jeopardy so much. You know what I mean? Hell no, not this early in the morning. Full English and a, blo is a, bloody, heart, is a bloody heart attack. Is it? Is it really? Is it that bad? I don't know what these are. Shout out Rain Energy. Hashtag not sponsored. Hashtag that'd be cool as fuck though. Mm. My friends, I want to thank every single one of you guys for coming out and supporting tonight for real man i did not expect this turnout i figured a couple of people would roll through and it'd be it is what it is especially for a video with the thumbnail just <clears throat> just a play mat you know what i mean but this is a creator milestone for me uh for youtube and i'm really looking forward to working with your play mat and like i said if you guys do go and want to check them out you can find them right here uh the link is in the description laura keeps blasting it as well too because she's a legendary last thank you so much for your help laura appreciate you for real and a bounce back over here and guys we are without further delay hashtag that'd be cool as fuck though there we go lord drop <laughs> do you see daniel arsham is working on a charizard statue i uh, won't be able to afford it but i decided to see what it looks like deke did you hear that did you just hear that what bleed teal just said we got to get on it bro we got to get on our thing almost 50 likes let's go if you guys haven't already <laughs> mega punch the shit out of that like button then pull your fist back and get ready to do it again to the notification bell if you would not mind that would be sick no thank you trey no thank you joe i'm canadian so you will not win the thank you battle but thank you 50 is reasonable five more let's go
please and thank you guys trainers we are hold on where is it we'll go here this is fine we are about to go Zard hunting yo courtesy of the brolum yo michael jeffrey courtesy of you guys essentially yo thank you kindly we're about to rip into these and hopefully pack an orange flaming fire lizard out of at least one of them we're gonna leave xy evolutions for last because for the culture you know what i mean yes joe we got that exactly bro pokemon 2019 says rip the packs that's exactly what's gonna go down boom right there we got a pack out coming for you guys we got an ev promo right here as well too and of course an alolan executor coin I almost feel like I want to keep this, but I'm not going to. 10 years from now, I'll be like, shit. If YouTube takes the likes away again, I'm going to fly from Ireland and storm the headquarters and throw hands. Don't tell them that. They'll shut the channel down. But I will. I'm right there with you. I will riot. All the likes came back on the other ones, which was weird. Maybe it's because we complained. Uh, pack code right there for you guys. Hopefully someone super scooped that up. 50 likes, 50 more likes, and I open on Broken Bonds. Yo, if we hit 50 more likes, that would be sick. I got to sleeve that Eevee real quick. Guys, again, for real, thank you so much, man. I'm so stoked. I'm just looking at the pack of these again. I'm just like, man, let's go. I'll be doing, like I said, another more thorough review. I'll give you guys some more details and more updates. If you want to actually scoop them up for now, in the meantime, you can just hit them up via email, just like Laura is leaving in the description. Um, and of course, we have the single winner tonight, Mud Pie, winning herself one of these game mats. We're going to be giving two away on IG alongside an entire pack of these sleeves. So let's go, guys. Let's get them out there. You know what I'm saying? I think it's pretty cool. I like it. If I seen these on a shelf, I'd be like, holy fuck, yes, please. You know? Oh, you're doing two? I missed something. Yes, we are. I am. I am. And of course, this super got a shiny a little on executor coin right here, mate. It's real nice. Fucking I. I'll take that right there. Out of the coin collection, you know? Alright. First pack. We're gonna just No, we're gonna pet the Umbreon's ears nicely. Sylveon. I said Umbreon, please nobody roast me. It took me two seconds to readjust there. Alright, I got this. You're doing too? Yes, I am. Let's go. Doing it. Oh, snap. You got it, Trey. I'm hoping for the best. Let's get this. Oh, that was crispy because that's been in there for a minute. All right, we got a pack code. Oh, my God. I would be so stoked. Oh, my God. If we hit anything. There's so many possibilities of any spice coming out of these. Let's get it. Much cooler than the sleeves that you usually see in stores, that's for sure. Yeah. there. I mean, I've seen some pretty dope ones, but I like the uh, thought that I could just make up some really cool shit to put on the back of some stuff, you know? Radicate three eyes shit hearing <laughs> triple acceleration energy Meltran <laughs> slow poke jabroni I'm booking a flight right now I'm Irish and I'm ready yeah of course <laughs> with a pint of Guinness in my left hand <laughs> that is legendary oh yo I miss this slow poke artwork so sick man gotta love the poke you know whooper whoops whooper whooping right there sand dial at least he corrected himself before no one corrected him i got it really quick you know what i'm saying oh so sick with the larvitar stuffy wow way too cute catterday is the attack oh my god i gotta put off this off to the side to show snorlax okay catterday reverse hollow tentacool that is tentacruel but let's see if the next card in this pack will be tentacruel and i don't mean the actual pokemon i just mean fucking savage it knows bubble jutsu i never noticed that that is actually sick yo it's a naruto cool tenta naruto cool i'm lucky to see multiple colors in my store bars all right are you ready guys wow all righty then followed by some fire energy darkness just like my soul just just like my soul well you know what they say someone tell me what they say because what i'm about to say is that fucking sucks but grateful for every single pack that we crack and slow punk yep that's pretty much it right there friendos yeah uh, you should see if they could use polarized film before doing a thin overlaying uh overlaying your graphic on the back that way the hall it's a hollow bleed would cost more what you know yo so what's something i would i would say that's cost effective in the curb appeal of that of that sleeve that is a sick idea joshua i could probably inquire it's really awesome i've been talking um just with one of the like top representatives there just about some like hypotheticals and they're like stoked to work in a lot of different capacities and i'm stoked i'm really they haven't even seen this commercial yet or that little thing that i put together and i want to do one like 10 times better but like I just want to see what they think of that at first, and then I can gauge, like, you know, what I can put into it, but... Alright. So. Trainers. 
fellow cardboard connoisseurs, Polk enthusiasts, magic fanatics, Yugi bros, fanimes, fans of anime. I just made that up just now. Does that work? Hey, nice play, Matt. Where can I get that one? I'm so happy you asked, Joe Kryptonite. Do you want to see a commercial, bro? Is that... <laughs> Back of pack is right, bird man. That's where the bulk goes, my friend. Guys, I am like, oh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to rip this, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut it nice, and I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see if I can preserve the front of this. Actually, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to. We're gonna go from the side right here. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna see if I can do this. And this is just gonna be a pack art that I keep, um, for like, nostalgic purposes. Yeah, yeah. Let's do this like this. Where's my scyther sigh? Kids, don't play with knives. Look at even the blade. Look at even the Scyther Psy blade. <sighs> Remember that thing you used to do in school? The kids would do? You know what I'm saying? That fucking thing? Remember people used to... Uh, bro, who does this? Be honest right now. Who's still doing this? You know what I'm saying? Who's still doing that? But anyway, just the... Look at that. That's nice. Get Charmander holding that knife. Here, bro. Check it. It's like he's got a fucking sword. Look at that shit. Look at that. Wait. <laughs> Yo, come on. We need some grass energy in the chat for some good luck on this last pack magic, guys. Thank you so much for coming to hang out. Thanks for coming to support tonight. Thanks for coming to check this out. Thanks for dealing with me fucking bumping that commercial 10 times. Thanks for dealing with the lateness. Just being cool, man. I appreciate you guys so much. I put a lot of work into this shit, and I do it to have fun with you guys, and I hope you guys have fun with me. So slice the bottom and see if the pack will come out easily. b till. that is exactly what I'm going to do. Great Pokemon minds. Think alike, Brolem. For real. Me. Guys, we're going to bump that commercial one more time on the outro for sure. Mm-hmm. Bro. Michael Jeffrey, thank you kindly, man. Bro. First of all, guys, let me know what you think about Swolazard with a fucking sword now, because that's just badass, if I do say so myself. Secondly, but more importantly... Bro, Michael Jeffrey just dropped 699 super chat and said, man, I'm going to replace a bunch of your packs so you can have an awesome mail day video. We'll talk over IG and figure out the logistics, 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 logistics or logistics. How do you, how would you logistics or logistics, logistics, bro, Michael Jeffrey, yo, dude, thank you. Seriously, man, I can't take you guys. Some days it's just too much, bro. <laughs> Let's go. That's insane, man. Thank you so much. Legendary gentleman. All right, Swolazard, I'm sorry to take your sword away. He's probably pissed, but I have to do it. Let me see here. Clubber said, uh, Trey, in the, oh, I think the other room, watching, ask her to let me get my Mewtwo. Hey, um, Mrs. Clubber, if it's not too much to ask, if it's okay, at, at any time that it's convenient collectively, um, if you got, if you wouldn't mind, um, uh, Clubber would like to get a Mewtwo tattoo of the of the type or of the kind. If I am uh, able to render services to his liking, um, mayhaps he get that. Please, pretty please, just a little please with a little ch cherub on top, a little cherub on top. You know what I'm saying? That's a Pokemon. Poke puns. Poke Padre with the rune two hander. I fucking love that em emoji. Yo, can we make that a Zard hunting emoji official? Until I get some of those made. Yo, who knows an emoji making person? I need emojis made. I would need that for members. Members get emojis. There's one step, guys. Just want that Mewtwo head with purple outline so it looks like his energy around him. Ooh! We could do that. Ooh, that's a clean scythe, Scyther slice. Scyther! Oh, yeah, let's go. It's like I've handled a blade before. Look at that. That's clean, man. Look at preserved. Ooh! I'm doing that to every evolutions pack from now on. That is nice, man. Look at that. So stoked. That's going right up on my board, literally right here. Boom. I know you guys can't see that. I could if I turn this around, but then it's... Yeah. Yo, yeah, guys. There's uh, there's going to be opportunities for you guys to receive something like that if you're interested and you're able to get out to Ontario, Canada, where I'm located. I'd be glad to render services to the best of my abilities. Um, Let me see here. What else we got? mats and sleeves uh next up is <laughs> yo binders would be sick bro so much more nicer than i could have done thank you clubber I, I take care of my blades you know what i'm saying but don't play with them 
Um, yo, if you like them poke puns, kick it with me. If not, go bye bye. Ashes butter free. Yo, mayhaps he get that? <laughs> mayhaps, that's how you have to say it. Yeah. Mayhaps, please, please, mayhaps. Preservation at its finest. Thank you kindly. Got to pay respects. Isn't that crazy, man? At the end of the day, like, just to show you guys, like, I don't know where the fuck. Oh yeah, I put it directly in front of me. Wow, wow, that was bad, man. Yeah, man. Like, I have an appreciation. I know, like, people just rip these open, but like, you know, like, I'm not gonna have these all the time, right? And it's gonna be cool to look back on that memory on that day. So that's pretty sick. I should actually say, uh, put the date on it. That'd be sick. All right, friendos. We've got a last pack magic right here. Nice. Still get a cool uh, display piece. That's exactly it, Bleetail. That's exactly it. So if you guys know, you can do that. Jay Trisha. Yo. Legendary last. Got some early morning coins. Fucking I. On as you're getting ready for work, like, man. Stop it. Thank you so much. Like, come on, playmat looking saucy. It is, man. It's feeling saucy too. It is smooth as some sort of Pokemon related smooth item. It is smooth as an Ultra Ball. For real. It is nice. Thank you so much. J Trisha. That's that's English coins converting to like four billion Canadian dollars. Train next sponsor, your own strain, flamethrower. Ooh! Smack Daddy. It's crazy, bro. Maybe one day. That's crazy to even think, man. That's insane. Wish I had done that with the cosmic uh, blisters I tore through. Mm, yes. I pulled an extreme off center blaster CX from my last Evo pack. I would save. I would say 35% of the card is missing. Oh my god! I'll send you a pick on IG. I've never seen anything like it. Feel like it's worthless. No, bro. Joe Kryptonite. That is not worthless. Yo, if it's missing that significant amount of that, no. There are people who are like they're. People have a specific acquired taste, we'll say, or people who preferentially collect, or preferably, I should say, collect, um, like, miscut and off-cut cards like that. Because you gotta think about it, they're unique, right? It's still an official, like, actual, authentic Pokemon product, but it's unique because you don't find them a lot, right? It's not like a reoccurring thing or something you see consistently in the wild, all Pokemon and in pun intended, so. Yeah, bro, hold on to that. That is sick. I swear that English. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I will gladly see. Look at there you go, Bleed Teal right there. I will gladly take that off your hands. Let me submit. Look at that. As I'm saying that, Bleed Teal pipes up and says it. All right, friendos, this is the last pack of the night. I want to see some fire. I just want to see a wall of fire in the chat. Please and thank you. Let's drop it, get it in there, and then let's rip into this Evo pack. Of course, it's got to be a Blastoise pack too, right? Yo, come on. I'm still going to rub that cannon right there. That's your mind going somewhere where it shouldn't be, probably. I'm just hoping that's a good luck spot on that Blastoise right there. It's not the full art, just ultra rare. That's still sick, though, bro. Miscuts are probably more rare. See, third eye saying as well, too. Michael Jeffrey said, uh, send that shit to PSA and get a great a miscut grade. Exactly. I'll buy it. <laughs> See what I'm saying, bro? It's not worthless. Trust me, man. And that's what I love being able to do for you guys uh, when you come here. Like, anybody that comes in and out of the, the stream, like, it's cool to have a collective of people that are also willing to share information and knowledge and experience and insight and opinion and offer to buy stuff. And, like, guys, it's amazing. I know we have the Discord going. If you guys do Discord, roll into that. And uh, honestly, man, everybody in there is, like, there to help one another. So that's what I'm really about here, like, continually building, uh, building that up. So... Let's fucking go. Hashtag Hydro Pump Army. Smack Daddy, I love that. Dancing guy. It's the dancing man. That would be Secret Angel Man, but of course it is. Jolly Fish and dropping the fire as well, too. Thank you, Conley. Polka Gains with the flames. Yo, you like that, bro? Polka Gains with the flames. Trey rubbing the Hydro Pump Cannon. Gotta get it to pump out a good card. I want that, you know? I want that good card to just come exploding out of this pad that's too much bro plenty of miscut mispin groups on facebook people that will buy that card quick yep because they would grade it they would grade it all right friendos that's a nice wall of fire joe krypton i'll send you a pick if you think it's one of a kind you can throw the pick up yo bro def send it sender jolly fishing yo water for blastoise bro you know what i wouldn't i wouldn't even be mad if we hit a stoice tonight bro so yeah there you go poke a panda with a rune two-hander and the giant lizard with the fire i love it i love it all right guys give him a just a PG-13 rub on the forehead right there. And we're good to go. And we got the water there for Danny. All right. Guys, please. Dear Arceus, could we please have something? I don't know if this is going to... We're going to see this. Are we going to see it? Okay, no, we're good. 
xy evolutions pack code get that in for my fellow pokemon trading card game online players let's go um clubber 37 said trainer trade did you see the subway it's unbeatable no what do you mean bro what's the subway poke budget dropping some lightning up in here yo even if we get a holographic raichu out of here i'd be stoked with that alone you know what i'm saying all right let's get this friendos yo i have to go to let me see let me see is it this one i don't know if it's this one no it's not this one it's this one and this one all right last pack magic the net that nostalgia from xy evolutions michael jeffrey man if you guys wouldn't mind to go back and check out the video that i put it where it was like what pokemon cards to invest in or something like that and i put it out like last year and it was just talking about xy evolutions you'll see how many i scooped up at toys r us just casually the one day and then there was still like just an entire shelf left like crazy man but yeah the nostalgia man like i said this was the broke man's base set that's what i always speculated i always called it it's just the broke man's base set uh with the same amount of value of nostalgia coming out of it and i loved it and now it is crazy to think that i am sitting here cracking one pack going like oh you know what i'm saying so oh yeah deke subway and discord oh no i want subway god damn it check discord general chat deke had a sandwich uh sandwich off between jeff the ref and i no way oh man mega blastoise cx was uh in the online pack just fyi Ooh, joshua super scooping up the online pack code and getting a mega blastoise cx that's crazy dude thanks for letting us know man i really appreciate that like guys if you're hitting those packs kakuna Rattata means no means no what guys what does it mean it means no worries um stiffen giggity all right here we go pidgeot spirit link come on Bill Cosby's favorite Pokemon. I gotta finish off the rest of this rain. Shout out Rain Energy. Hashtag not sponsored. Hashtag that'd be cool as fuck though. Absolutely delicious beverage for coffee replacement. I want to see this sandwich off now. Here we go. Dig lit dig, dig lit dig. I want a better slapper than this. What else we got? Nah, I don't like that. I don't like this one. I do, but I don't. What else? Ooh, yeah, this is nice. It's not super hype, but it's just, it's good. It's good. Clubber one, no contest. Legit the mascot of Subway Sandwich is so bomb. Yo, I wish I could just muck a giant Subway Sandwich. Oh, can't do it. Chicken, broccoli, and rice. I'm going to post my dinner tonight on IG. Plain Jane, but delicious. Ooh, the Brola, man. Let's go. Dude, it's your son. Look, it's like Pride Rock, kind of, right? We're going to see the next card, though, but check it out. Seal. Oh, smack it. It's like Pride Rock. Look it. He's holding his son. My son. One day. <laughs> all right. Put in this. I was drinking rain for a while. Not bad. Yo, it's not bad at all whatsoever. I don't mind switching it up every once in a while. Like, I'll have a coffee or I'll have a rain. You know what I'm saying? Let's go seal magnemite magnemite let's get this friendos come on man please dear rcs one pack give us one pack we have not had one good pack tonight am i mistaken or have we had not one good pack out of everything we've cracked i think i'm right here okay oh come on what is it <laughs> i'll take it i will definitely take the chancy for sure i will definitely take the chancy it's funny that we guess yo that's what mud pie won uh, one of these mats with earlier look at chancy all right guys let's go 40 legendary type trainers in here right now fellow cardboard pack cracking connoisseurs let's get it if you guys would not mind please mega punch the shit out of that like button and then cock it back again and then mega punch the notification bell ring it like the hunchback of notre dame and uh yeah subscribe and like and all those other things youtubers say because it helps bro it definitely does i feel like just the word in the algorithm yo like subscribe and hit the notification i feel like that helps in general chancy iconic oh ironic quite actually it's iconic and ironic don't you think a little bit ironic you are indeed correct, I am. 
Joker King was good. Oh, Third Eye, you're right. We did pull Joker King. That was good. Actually, our, our magic pulls were good. Marsh Flats. But I was talking about Pokemon. I was talking about Pokemon. I swear if it's a leak slapping bastard, I'm done. Deke, if it is a leak slapping Pokemon, I will shut this channel down right now. I will literally shut <laughs> I will shut this down. Are you ready? I tail whip that like button, smack daddy. Thank you. Guys, I'm going to no looky looky this. Are you ready? Okay. I'm no, I'm not gonna look. We're doing this. Chazad? I hope so. Let's get it. Oh wait, we're doing it the wrong way. Okay. I'm gonna finish the rain. Finish the rain. Leaf energy. A little bit more leaf energy. Some special effects. Let's do this. Okay. <clears throat> A big thank you. Three, two, one, this is on you guys. This is on you guys. Oh my god. <sighs> Alright. I'm going to leave it for a second. I'm going to flip it over. Let's go. No looking at all, so I had to. The suspense is killing me too, man. This is what I like, man. I want to make a video where I hype up one single pack. Like, I want to make, like, the most, like high budget but not high budget because i can do it myself because it's just high budget because it would cost a lot you know what i'm saying but fire good pack it's a hollow fire fire sweet yeah right yo come on you find the white gummy bear rain yet no clubber i would i wish all right fire but it's not charizard hey I will take that. I will definitely take a holographic nine tails. Most certainly. Let's go. Yo, reverse holo chancy and a holographic nine tails are not bad whatsoever at all. I don't know why the back of that one looks different if I'm tripping. No, I'm not. I'm not tripping. Yo, let's leave them or leave them both. Where are they? We didn't use them all. I don't want to use my other sleeves, but the hollow looks good you guys are misleading him with the fire no not entirely like i knew like people would have been tripping out way more if it was charizard for sure chat would have went off but still epic nonetheless i'm gonna try and get it off here without fucking it up there we go we got this yo a good capper for the night that's not too bad we pull in some heat on the way out on the way out rocking some heat and I will take a reverse holo chancy and a holographic nine tails coming out of that bad boy pack right there and of course even the xy evolutions bulk I hold on to all of it like I never bulk out my xy evil bulk at all um I hold on to it that's just my personal preference how looks very clean you never know that's exactly it bro I'd be more uh like stoked about sending the chancy in and I kind of want to look let's see because I think the first ever one just graded a little while ago yeah no that's not happening that's 100% not happening but still clean man and still a badass card for real nonetheless well friendos i think that's gonna sum it up for tonight pulls from pokemon primarily being well nothing too too crazy but getting to open up some packs like that and having the opportunity to chase a charizard to go zard hunting is always something i'm extremely grateful for so thank you guys so much for real uh just to top it off we got the joker's knight coming from Yu Gi Oh, which is pretty sick um not too shabby at all of course the dakin right there that holographic shaman is noteworthy because man that that slaps that porygon z we got is pretty sick too marsh flats was our best pull from mtg or magic the gathering um coming around 30 bucks 28 bucks and then that holographic nine tails from xy evo still slapping and chancy which ironically was the pokemon that mud pie won one of these game mats these custom zard game mats zard hunting game mats yo mud pie you're gonna be able to hunt zards in style you know what i'm saying hunting zards in style so mud pie please don't forget to hit me up on ig of course you already have me on there but link is right there for anybody not following right now i've seen a psa 10 of nine tails going for 1k on ebay is that accurate Ooh, from xy evolutions i don't think so bro no not from xy evo um yo deke said gotta get going bro and congrats again bro so proud of how far you've come happy night everyone congrats again mud pie yo guys big shout out to deke tonight man thank you so much dude appreciate you a snorlax size shit ton and thanks for supporting as always bro from no matter what man appreciate you for real much love man you know thanks dude thank you um let me see evolutions is notorious for print lines yeah michael jeffrey it is savage for print lines absolutely ruthless for the most part guys don't forget don't forget we are going oh yo i have this playing my bad let me see there we go 
What is going on? There we go. Friendos. We are going to be giving away two more of these bad boys alongside an entire pack of sleeves for anybody here that's been in, in attendance for the Late Night Legendary live stream. What I want you guys to do for a better chance is after this video uploads, go and drop a comment, something to do with, I don't know, Charizard related. Drop a Charizard related comment. It could literally say Charizard related comment with some fire emojis. It could just say Zard Hunter with some swords and fire. Go drop a comment on this video afterwards. That's going to give you an extra opportunity to be entered into the giveaway for two of these game mats and a pack of sleeves. I'm probably going to do one like the first prize is going to be the pack of sleeves and the game mat and then the next one is just going to be the game mat. And again that is courtesy of the Brolin Polka Deep tonight. That is a big huge courtesy as well too. Your playmat right here, yourplaymat.com. I'm gonna have more details about it, guys, but for now, uh, Laura's been providing the links for it all all night tonight for the most part, which is absolutely friggin' awesome. And I appreciate it, Snorlax, I shit ton, but there is also the link in the description of this video um, where you guys can go and check out this website. It's gonna link you with my actual code. So if you guys wanna do something yourself, get your own custom stuff printed, you can. Um, you can inquire about that. If you guys are interested in one of those, you can hit them up and uh, they'll be able to hook you up as well too. Matt, yo, we're gonna roll out with that uh, that one more time. We're gonna roll out with the video one more time for sure. Of course, most certainly. Later nerds, Pokemon 2019, much love. Thank you. Jabroni Josh, J Trisha, Michael Jeffrey. Yo, Michael Jeffrey times two, bro. Thank you so much, Zard Lurking. Laura, Deke, Deke again, Anime Trey. I, that feels weird saying my own potential name in the future. Yo, too funny, yo. <laughs> Demon Trayer, that's so that's so much, man. Yo, Poke Padre, Smack Daddy, Canto Kitchen, Shifty Dragonite, for real. Appreciate you guys, every single one of you, man. Wes, J Trisha, I know I say people's names twice, okay? I apologize. That's how it goes. Birdman Productions, Jabroni Josh, I can't do it. Like, wait, wait, wait. I was okay, right? That wasn't too bad. The eyebrow was good. I was all right. A little bit not okay there we go sorry i was reading some of the comments from that nine tails pull again poca padre i don't know who, who else his names i missed yo bleed teal of course i'm just rolling up the list right here because i feel bad imagine if there was ever like a hundred people in this chat room i'd have to be like holy shit i gotta go to the back commercial again we're gonna get it autobots autobots roll out yo i love that have a good night my dude tetra as well man thank you so much eobar much love peace out crew yes crew that's exactly it crew gang squad family community you guys appreciate you so much i'm really stoked about this shout out to your playmat thank you guys again so so fucking much snorlax i shit ton for supporting somebody who's just being themselves being real appreciate you guys a lot clubber much love as well to third eye guys we're gonna leave off with charmander holding his sword because that's just legendary you know what i'm saying and we're gonna roll out that commercial one more time but as usual my friends we'll be streaming again tomorrow night we're gonna be streaming again tomorrow night we're gonna crack these open Oh, I got it. Boom. Charizard or Blastoise versus Venusaur. Get that rocking. You guys, come kick it tomorrow night if you'd like. But as always, until that time, you guys, train on, game on, stay epic, stay awesome, and that thing where I do an anime peace sign.